Yeah. Yeah, you put in that headphone. I will do that. That's how we start dreams. As Two Moons sits meditatively, very Darth Maul. As the, as the elephant goes a exploring. It's time for what may... Maybe this one isn't the last episode of our chaotic evil run of Kingmaker. But I don't know. But I think we're getting really close. But this is our chaotic evil run of Kingmaker. My name is Tommy. Her name is Lucia. Give us the power. Bam! Alright, so now... Oop, we already did that. Irrevetti's super dead. I feel pretty good about that. I don't feel really good about having four hit points. When did that happen? <laughs> oh my! When did that happen? So, I have a bear's endurance on me, I think. When did we get hecked on? Uh, the whole last session. There oh, were a lot they? of encounters. That ends in 40 seconds! Oh, God! The, oh, God! Bite the dust. Go, Giants! To the world map! Quickly open this door! What's that? What is this? What? Confusion? Oh, the door's open now? Oh, yeah! This is where those were rats are. That I never went and defighted. Anything else? Did you know Mastodon can't Applause, pick Applause, please! Replause, please! Give me all your stuff! I mean, technically, this castle's mine. Right? <gasps> Whoa! <laughs> oh my god! It's <laughs> Sudden Barbarian Death Syndrome strikes again! <laughs> oh my god! Man. Wouldn't even be because of rage this time, though. No, this is an Unchained Barbarian. He can't die to that. Oh, because... right! Yep. How do you feel about that, also? What it does is, is a. Uh, well, very frankly speaking, it's worse. I gotta keep watching my camera and make sure we're moving, because I know I'm gonna crash at some point. But, uh... Well, let's all pretend that didn't happen, now shall we? Anywho, in lieu of a plus four to Constitution, the Unchained Barbarian just gets, uh, two temporary hit points per level. So they can't die. It's, uh, uh... Their rage runs out and suddenly their max hit points have dropped. There might be something for the fourth save. I forget. I, to be honest, I've never played... Wait, Tommy. Tommy! To be honest, I've never played it. Oh, wait, I am currently, <laughs> currently playing. Right now, in fact. I'm, I'm right now playing the thing, yes. Rage. Plus two bonus on melee attack rolls, melee damage rolls, thrown weapon damage rolls, and will saves, and minus two armor class for two temporary hit points for hit die. So it's worse. Yeah, it's just worse. But it's much easier math. <laughs> yeah, that's true. I think the trade off's wrong. I would not make it myself. I understand why someone would. I think, I think in Tabletop Pathfinder it reads just damage rolls. Hmm. Or no, maybe. No, it does, it reads melee damage rolls, but that's important because that means you can build a dex barbarian, hmm. which is strictly better. Who will prevail? You know, I'm actually getting kind of tired. I need to play a character based around an ability score that I don't often use. And I'm not sure what that is. What is that? What's, what's happened? I'm on fire. Who's doing a heckin' alchem- Oh, oh well, she is beautiful. And immortal now, so it's fine. Speaking of immortal! Oh jeez! Oh! Oh! But so is Irivetti, so it's cool. Do we have any healing items? Yeah, it's called Cleric. Does Harem have Harem's my favorite spells? item. I mean, I have potions. We're fine. We're so fine. And if not, I can just walk out of here. That's true. Actually, no. Because I want to... I have been presented with three very challenging encounters at the end, and it's very reminiscent of Neverwinter Nights 2 for any of my friends and fellow gamers out there I'm who, who have lost their temper and also played that game. At the end, you have to fight a, a really powerful red dragon as like an optional end of game boss fight. This time we're just fighting a black dragon. Definitely my favorite name for any dragon ever. At the end of Neverwinter Nights 2, you almost had to cheat to beat her. Because she was real strong. Well, it wasn't. Wow. I, I guess you didn't have to cheat in like every yeah, every sense of the word. Rather, like literally, the only way you could do enough damage to beat her was to bring both the wizard and the sorcerer that the game staples you with, and they both had to just spam missile storm. That wow. was that was the only way you could beat her. I don't know what all she had on her. Because the Neverwinter Nights 2's UI was kind of weird, and there was no, like, what does the enemy have? Detect magic? Any of that kind of stuff. Mm. But she was real mean. 
But there's an option that you could fight her with some fire giants too. Like the fire giants would turn on her. And then you could attack the fire giants or oh, sadness. Or you could attack uh just her and the fire giants would help. And the fire giants obviously are a great help against a red dragon. What with that community. Yep, very helpful, very handy. What was her name? She had the best name, and I can't I can't even know something now. God, what was it? Oh man! Time for fun! Mm. I often get it confused with some of the names Joe used for his dragons, because it's the same. There are a lot of like Z's and Y's. God, what was her name? Thalopsix! Her name was Thalopsix. And that name is super sweet. Like the uh, beautiful glaive of true beauty here. Sing a song! No, no. Sing a song! Kill the children! Alchemist even have line of sight. He doesn't need it. He only needs to be able to target the square, which is a decent one. Assuming that works that way in this. I have no idea. Who is it? It's you. You nerd! You nerd! Get the nerd! Come on. Oh, man. This is a hard fight. We something. need to go for him first. Yeah, we do. We can't quite reach him, so let's, uh... I don't think Web gives you the grapple condition. I could be wrong. Now, all I need is somebody who's fire-resistant to run up, because then that Web will set fire. Can I just not get in the door? Is that is that what the deal is here? Yeah, it really is. Uh, ah! Two! No! You, you step it! War rat! That's what you get. Who's left? Who ain't? Who's not suffered a horrible, miserable death all wrong? That's all we need is Regangar and Lindsay. Yeah. I never use resources in this game because it's too fast-paced for me. I honestly just can't quite keep up. Which that means old Gongar here has all the resources. Now let's go, uh. Well, he's fine. Can we go? Uh. What are you doing, my guy? Whatever, that's fine. I prefer you that close. Ah, yes, we're Gongar. And so said he, he shall cut you. Let's look at your insidey bits. So saith we're Gongar. Where, where are we going? Hey, yo! Oh. Oh. That's neat. Upside of having all my stuff still. That hurt. I don't like it. Bam! You, I have something special. Should I? No. But I really, really want to! Ah, yes. And then the three acid damage from Mighty Queen Lindsay. Coming to save the day! Bam! Oh, come on. Bitten at each other. Yeah, so they do, man. Ooh. Go, kitty kitties. All right. Did anybody have anything worth remembering at all? Not particularly. Oh, a token of the dryad. Yes, because we trust her. She's good, safe, good friend. Not trying to abuse the kingdom at all. Ooh. Oh yeah, that's a. Ether attack. Oh, Lindsay. Oh, everyone else. Oopsie. Die for me. Gone, Gar. That's not necessary. None of that is necessary. We're just trying to loot some bodies. And then we're gonna go see what's happened with now Irvetti dead in a ditch somewhere. Oh, what? Well, speaking of dead in a ditch somewhere, my, my guy! Why you do this? Jay. Oh, she's still stuck in the web. That's why she's rolling combat maneuvers. Oh, wait. I forgot. I have a I have a question. I have four levels of druid and or eleven levels of druid, four levels of inquisitor. Right. How am I proficient with the rapier? I'm not. Unless I took a feat somewhere, and I don't think I did. 
Inquisitor is proficient with simple weapons, plus in Jethel's case, the scythe, Urgothos' favorite weapon, and then druids are like their own set of proficiencies, none of which is the rapier. You're right, you're right. And I, I was thinking about that at work today, like, how I can't. I cannot use that weapon. Unless I took martial weapon proficiency at some point, and I'm just not remembering it. Vital Strike, Improved Initiative, Outflank, Boon Companion, Combat Casting, Toughness. Why? Oh, because she has no con, I guess. Yeah, sure. Weapon Focus, Improved Vital Strike. Jathel can't use that weapon. I didn't realize Inquisitor's only got simple weapons. That stinks. Mm -hmm. Well, yes and no. Simple plus their deities favored. Mm. So, like, that's how Josh's Inquisitor is using a great axe. Anything else? Because Rov- Aha! Because Rovagog. I won't be halted. Maybe they get more than that. Maybe I'm maybe I'm just super wrong. Hang on. Stand by everyone. We gotta do some math and stuff. Oh, she's an elf, duh. Elves get free proficiency with rapiers? Yeah. You knew that. I that was that was in 3.5 too. Proficiency with the longbow, shortbow, longsword, and rapier. I didn't realize the rapier was on the list. I guess I only literally ever used it for the longbow. And as a pathfinder, every weapon with elven in its name is treated as a marshal. That's how she's using a rapier. Okay. There we go. Can confirm has elf stats, but isn't paying for the con meg because it's Zambo. So then, I guess that begs the question, doesn't it, babe? What? Is she... Really an elf? <laughs> okay. Whoa! The corpses! Hello! Hello! I forgot about you! Give me all your stuff, p tags Heralde! Oh, wait, I couldn't- I couldn't do all this last time. Because Lindsay was dead and gone, I had to go grab her, huh? Uh-huh. Oh, no, I came back and did this. That's what seemed to open the front door in the first place. Let me just dot my T's and cross my lowercase J's. Okay, I think we're good. Off we go, we're gonna get out of this place. This place is a place of evil. Because it's now my place. So we are a place of evil. No, we are a people of evil. We're not a thing of evil. That's the kind of noun we are. Come on! Why does Amiri have freedom of movement on her? Not that I'll question. Man, that's so many potions. I feel like I'm playing on super easy mode. If everyone has a potion to cure moderate wounds. Off we go! There we go. <laughs> True dragons can live up to a thousand years or more, becoming more powerful with each year's passing. Usually, elder dragon. Basically, something something dangerous dragon. But... Basically means more dangerous. Well, right here. Basically means more dangerous dragon. This monitor is broken, so I have to read it on OBS. We're cool! I don't ever really want to replace this monitor, though. What? Why? It's mine. You can't tell me to replace it. I cannot tell you to replace it. So why should I replace it? Because it's broken. No, it's not. There's just a little goop there. It's broken. It's not broken. Okay. Do you have a bunch of money to throw out around to buy me a monitor? I cannot. Then, yeah, I'm not going to replace it. I, I mean, don't have the money for that. I'm not saying tomorrow. And I probably never will. If I have an extra hundred bucks floating around, or however much a monitor costs, I'm going to spend it on stuff I need. I like insulin. Whoa, what's happened? Oh. Who are you, nerd? Eobald the Insightful. Your Highness, if you left the, pa the palace alive, you must be the new king of P-Tax. As Victor, you deserve a much more stately greeting, but I'm afraid we'll have to postpone the festivities. Your new subjects are in urgent need of help. Professor Eobald, what are you doing here? It's dangerous for you here. I came because I was worried about you, but I'm not the one who's in danger right now. There are riots in the city. A crowd has gathered around the Academy of the Grand Arts, and they're out for blood! I beg you, you must, ugh, I beg you, you must interfere before it's too late. Can I rest first? I'm gonna, I'm gonna rest first. Hope that's cool. I don't think it's cool. No! All right. Thing. How droll. Versus drink a million potions. Pretty much. Mmm. Nah, I like my odds. 
I have the shiny rainbow spear! Famous last words. Man, you are just here to antagonize me and make fun of my broken equipment, aren't you? No, I'm not. I'd be fooled. Yes, let's walk right up to them. A crowd of citizens armed with whatever they could find. Bludgeons, daggers, torches, murmurs indignantly. They've listened to Aldani, a man. What? They're listening to Aldani? Alondi? Al sorry, I uh, couldn't read it. A man in expensive clothing lies at his feet, writhing in a puddle of blood as he presses his hand over a wound. You gather from the screaming crowd that this must be the nun Nunzio uh, Arapat Arpatia, Ayurvedi's master. Arpaya? There's no T in that. Ar sorry. Um, Arpaya? Arpaya? Uh, Ayurvedi's master of ceremonies. Citizens of Pitax, for too long we have tolerated a tyrant as he trampled our city into the mud. We'll no longer. We, m we must must we fear telling the truth. You've all read the book by Eobald the Insightful. The only art out of the Academy of the Grand Arts was that of licking Ayurvedi's boots. We students were trained not as bards, but as jesters, like this man here. Alondi kicks Nunzio in the ribs, but he seems to have stopped moving entirely. Enough of this mockery. Our art is finally free. We'll build our own academy once we've burned this travesty to the ground. Wait, what are you doing? We, we didn't write the book for this. Alondi, have you no shame? Do I have to remind you why you were... Alondi interrupts Lindsay, raising... Uh, elated screams from the crowd. Look, it's Lindsay! The hero who revealed the truth to all of Pitax! Hurrah, hurrah! Glory to the heroes of the resistance! Down with Irovetti! Burn the academy! That guy's slimier than a slug. Doesn't matter how many chances you give the likes of him. If they were shit, they'll stay shit. Hey, little one, can I kick him? Or do you want to do it? <laughs> Pigs! I'll burn you! Man, why can't I slaughter the townsfolk? That's so... Alright. Single townsfolk. Alondi really wants a piece. Oh, he got one. Lindsay looks abashed, tears in her eyes. This is my fault. This is all because of my book. This isn't what I wanted. We covered for Alondi, hoping to give him a chance to change. As a result, we made a hero. Handed him a knife and a torch. Nunzio's blood. It's on my hands. Professor Eobold said everyone deserves a second chance. But how many chances does someone have to throw away before we admit they're just an animal with no desire to change? Dang, Lindsay. <laughs> this when you think you're ready for the rev, but then it actually happens. This old book was a terrible mistake. Sure, bards tell people stories, but what kind of stories? Sweet tales to lull their conscience and promise that things will be alright despite the facts? If that's a bard's calling, then I'd have been better off in my hometown growing turnips. At least some good would have come of it. Sorry, I'm reading. So none of these are stop being a bard. No. Words are stupid. No words for you. <laughs> you a bard's job is to entertain the audience. Don't take responsibility for someone else's deeds. Do you really think so? But they taught us. They taught. Damn it all. Why does it matter what they taught us? If it all ends like this with stupidity and blood, then to hell with the bard's calling. The audience is made of idiots, and my calling is to entertain them. Thank you. Seriously, thank you. You brought me to my senses. I might have wandered a maze of pretty words and foggy ideals until I was old and gray. Let's go. I don't want to see P-Tax or the Academy or any of these faces ever again. Nice. I made... Dang, Lindsay. Nah, she's not... Did she just lose all her part levels? I'd much rather her be just a sylvan sorcerer all the way up. More importantly, my boy's got a big old heckin' level... Okay, so I'm level 15. I'm gonna get a feat this level. That's super important because if that wasn't the case, I was gonna go retrain because I'm stupid and I'm so used to all my weapons having keen on them that I never take improved critical, which is the feat that I need to take like right now. Right now. Because then I would have a 15 to 20 times through weapon. But I'm going to level 15, aren't I? Or am I going from 15 to 16? Uh, okay, so I'm gonna take a fire level then. Because this very well may be the last level. Because I don't think this will take me to 20. I don't have very high hopes anyway. Yeah, you'll definitely want that improved critical. Right, I think that's more important than DR. Call me crazy. Agreed. Improved critical choosing at long last. 
the Fischard, and I don't feel taxed for it. Yeah. And now Serpent's Prince is 15 to 20 times 3. Ooh. Which is enormous. Spicy. Yeah. All right, time to loot this town. Oh, yeah. Oh, come on. Um, I guess that's it. Yeah. Giant holy symbol of Calistria. That, that's what that. I did. That's what I did in the in-person game. Oh, also, like, <laughs> you see. Had an NPC do like oh, what, is, what is like sort of the sign of the cross, but with like holy symbol of Calistra. Remember, just remember they died, because this is dumb. He died too. They yes. all died. I wonder why they don't let you fight them. Ooh. 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 Okay. I'll take that one. We're keeping that one. Yeah, we are, because that's the next thing I'm doing is I'm going to go fight that dragon. Oh, right now? Sweet. I mean, I mean I'm going to go nap. Jesus. You might think I'm poor, and you might like to make fun of me on my stream in front of all my loving fans, but I'm not that dumb. I'm going to take a nap before I go fight a monster. I already fought a lot of monsters, and I'm in desperate need of a nap. Don't stop that! Applause, please. No, that's no good for us at all. Oh, no. Yes! Valerie, someday. I mean, Jaithel probably could go to Lawful Evil. Did her alignment change also? No, Absolutely. she remained any. The core of her controversy wasn't really alignment based like it is with most characters. The core of her controversy was kind of bad. Yeah, it was. Like, I don't know what I got for killing her kid. It seems to be that, like, she can't ever die. But she couldn't before. Well, like, she right? doesn't have plot armor. I'm pretty sure she could have been destroyed before. I think only Lindsay and Tristan have plot armor. Erefeti was dead, and good riddance. Our ruler added the crown of Pitax to the crown of the Stolen Lands. But behind the dead monarch loomed the shadow of a much more dangerous foe. A Naga that I don't understand why was there at all! Dildo, like, we must have missed some stuff with Yuravedi that would have explained why he had a Naga, but... Silliness. I can still go meet Octavia's mama. First, I'm gonna take a nappy. But don't I own this? Can I nappy here? I should. I probably can't nappy here. I probably gotta go all the way back. All the way back to Tuskdale. Oh, jeez. Oh, oh, jeez. Fast travel. Teleport. Teleport. Fast teleport. We have so many people that could have teleport on their spell list. Yep. Two right there. Resting would be nice, don't you? We're gonna rest when we get to the house, Lindsay. Just push. <laughs> Just push. They can do it. Oh, they can do it. They yeah. can do it. We are so good. We are so good. Oh, boom. Nap time. And then dragon time. Actually, I'm gonna check on the events in the throne. Because if something hasn't happened by now. We can probably add Patax to our map. I have rank 10 military also. I'm still a little upset that I had no bearing on me. On, on anything that just happened. I require. Do I have enough of this stupid Sky Metal? Storyteller? Come on, man. Matchmaker, matchmaker. I found the shards of stuff. Well, at least I know there's 17 pieces. Oh. Why well, well, did I say that? Let's, let's roll again here. Well, yeah, so... Well, okay, on. so that might have changed, or maybe I wasn't reading. Seven for that. 11 for Trailblazer's Helm. Okay, so it does tell us, I guess. Oh, good. I'm so good at reading. I ah, see we forgot to put a cat up. Oh, He'll be fine. He'll go away. I think just keep talking loudly and he won't show up on my stream. Okay. So I have... The need to sort... Oh, no. Name. Sort by the May. Nama. One, two... Oh, yes, I forgot. I have a parrot. Go over here. Why did I drop that? Thank you. Two wyverns is more important. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. I'm nowhere near... Nowhere near at all. Ah, oh, jeez. 
That's really hard to do. That is really hard to do. Wow. I'm still mad that a rank 10 military couldn't attack attacks. Or do anything, it seems. Yeah. I prioritized that for kind of a reason. Because I assumed it'd be either Patax or the Sword Lords. Yes. Would have something to do with me, and I would just stick my army on them. Yep. And I just, I don't know. Like, I get wanting to make the kingdom do stuff. Look at that. Yeah, that's pretty sweet. That's good stuff. But, like, if you're gonna make the kingdom do stuff, it should be able to do a lot of stuff. I agree. Well. Let's do that, I guess. Ooh, seven sold that soul jar. So then do I... Meh. Heh. Ooh. Patex. Patex. Oh, man, that made me jump. Events, population census. I think that's anything worth anything. Plus three to community. And then the show fail on a 95. Oh no, we're gonna do all 100. Get to it, Octavia! Oh yeah! And this is just training. So it seems like nothing important happened. No one has immediately tried to give me a better weapon. My rank 10 military is not attacking anyone. Resting would... Resting would what, Lindsay? Resting would what? Is what I thought. It would be nice. In my big king bed. <laughs> There is a whole delegation from P-Tax to see you. They are standing by the doors, scowling at each other. It looks like they're about to come to blows. Hey, one more of those and I'll have the troubleshooter achievement. Uh, Gaspare Liacenza. Liacenza. Greet you with a polite bow. Your Highness, the old families, founders of P-Tax, are grateful to you for sparing us of the usurper's tyranny. Allow us to assure you in our loyalty. None of the trade houses seek the Pataxian crown, which is rightfully yours, of course. If it would please you to appoint a governor to oversee the city, all four of the families humbly recommend me for this position. Uh, Carne Viril stares at Gaspare with dim, bloodshot eyes. Your Highness, of course it wasn't always peaceful between us. The Thieves' Guild used to fight a fight against you a little, but that's all water under the bridge, right? Irivedi's rule has ended, and the Guild, represented by me, promises you our support and our share of the profits. Speaking of profits, if you appoint me as governor, then your share will make you gas. Yes, money. The gnome smiles and rubs his hands together. Sweet, sweet, you will see, Your Highness. You make no mistake. Kill him? Oh. Gasparilla lowers his head and speaks coldly through clenched teeth. As your highness wishes. Kill him. So we've decided on the governor. Would you like to say anything to the visitors, or are they free to go? There's a whole crowd of them waiting in the hall. God! I sentence Gasparilla to put the bar to death! Your highness, but why? But, but why? Hehe, <laughs> serves him right. Who's pale as sheet? <laughs> Lizzie, what's next on the agenda? <laughs> you must decide the fate of the academy. And poor Gaspare gis gis gloom per per Your Highness, I ask that you relieve me from my post as headmaster of the academy. After all that has happened, I am hardly worthy of keeping. It. So is it that? I don't remember, but I think that's the name of the girl with plot armor from the hunt. Right. There's definitely a bard from Patax that went to the big hunt. And I think it was her. It's been a little while. No, it was her. Yes, and yeah. it be the bar. The most famous bard in all of Patax gives you a charming smile. For the first time, I completely agree with my respected colleague. And if you don't have another candidate for the position, please allow me to offer my services. No headmaster. No books. Lindsay's face becomes a little sad, but then she nods. That's a big mistake, your highness. An unforgivable mistake. Do you really care nothing of how history will remember you? It's a pity, but maybe it's the right thing to do. Is that all? Is there anyone else who can't wait to be seen? Kill her, finally! We've waited from the hunt. Kill her, haha! <laughs> what? No, you would dare! For what? No plot armor anymore! Ha ha ha, yes! Lindsay covers her face and turns away. Aww. Can I kill the other one? Yeah. The guards take 
And a meat away, so I kick Execute that one too! Oh, I oh. deserve this. Yeah, you do. <laughs> well, that's just oh mean. Oh my, this is, this is a giant mess. And... Who else dares? <laughs> Who's next? <laughs> Rusi Khaleesi, captain of the guard, comes to pledge allegiance to his king. I like this guy. Irse Kel Khaleesi, uh, greets you with a reserved bow. Your Highness, according to the tradition set forth by the first kings of Petax, I have come to pledge my allegiance to the king and its citizens before you and the crown. I shall serve Petax lo uh, faithfully and loyally to my dying breath and guard the peace of its streets. Mm -hmm. Swear to me! Oh, because that's the order as set by the first kings of Petax. The city guard has always served a counterbalance to the trade houses, even whichever one presently holds the crown. We exist to guard the city's peace and prevent a bloody power struggle. That's why we answer not to the king, but to the people. Nah, I'm gonna retire the city guard. I'm gonna create a new one, which is personally loyal to your boy. This is a rash decision, your highness. It may cause civil unrest. But that's a <laughs> This is great. Oh my god. <laughs> Kill them all. Really? And I thought Pitax had its worst days under Ayurvedi. Those times will soon be seen as our golden age. GG, nerd. Yeah, probably. <laughs> Measuring his pace, here he leaves a company by the guard. We're done with the guards. Who else is left? Ah, yes, Elora Nusky and her river razors. Oh, I remember her. I saved her. Yeah. Hello, Your Highness. Well, I'm. Um, what's next? To be honest, my fellows and I got so much loot storming the palace that we could live uh, in comfort to a ripe old age. But I think it's still a little early for us to retire. Will you hire us to serve you? We've shown ourselves in battle, and we promise to serve you faithfully and loyally. Mmm, you help me, but you're pirates and pirates hang. Guards, no. Yes, they thought they were trading up indeed. They're not, no, they traded down. Um, you can continue on your do, but don't forget to. I can't totally read, yeah. Do your thing, just don't forget to share. Ha, <laughs> as you wish, Your Highness. And don't you worry, you'll be getting your share on time. Man, I am a bad king. You are such a bad king. I love it. With a gap tooth grin, Alora leaves the throne room. No one else. Well, what a day. What a day. So much death. I see it's not easy to rule. I'd rather break up a pack of wyverns than live through another day like this. We've done that a lot in yeah. Kingmaker, though. Community plus 28. You shouldn't have disbanded the guard. Can you imagine what'll happen to the city without it? Oh, my poor old Pitax. Yeah, 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 we'll be fine. The finest. Kingdom PDHQ is thriving with his subjects. Of course, two will be resting in his laurels. So, what? A quest? A quest? A quest? I finished the quest! What does that mean for me? I have decided the fate of P-Tax. Well, okay. Regiones. I don't know what this is, but we're gonna do it. Go forth, harem! Ooh, that was the last result. She should be a lot more grateful she did <laughs> through that day. Not many did, indeed. It has not been the best. Capital crime. You can't beat the criminals, lead them. Tax has everything one could hope for. One well, means to build capital crime. It provides 55 or... That many bips? All crime-related town buildings provide full bonuses if you support the bandits more than the common folk as community rank group. Every 30 days reduces that by one noise. Mm, you're not busy anymore. Bartholomew of the cat. Whatever, who cares? Blah. Meh. Economy. <gasps> oh, I can build a town! One of my villages can become a lively tune! Get get out of there, stop with your senses! Can I not? You already sent her. Hello! Hello, Octavian! Oh, yeah, she's good. Just let it, just let it six days left. The regent demands my. Who's my regent? No. Octavia. Oh, I was like, wait, hold on, no one. That was Tristan, but yeah, it's Octavia. Octavia, mm -hmm. whom is out. Tristan was the 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 counselor. Mm -hmm. No counselors here. We don't worry about mental health here at uh, Two Moons' Kingdom. We worry about mastodon health, and one of them is missing, but is right there. And I, maybe I'm just going to turn on the retrain mod really quickly, and make the mastodon like ope out and come back. That's an option. I don't know. Octavia looks embarrassed. I've come with a request. 
Could you find a diplomat to handle negotiations and politics? Oh, we did that. Yes, I lack the stamina to lead such complicated discussions, and I don't have time for all of politics. Your subjects grow in number and their problems multiply. It seems almost everyone demands attention, the girl smiles timidly. Speaking of their problems, I keep hearing about how difficult it is to your subjects outside the kingdom, especially in Brevoy these past few weeks. Their merchants overcharge our peasants and use their connections to force our people into disadvantageous agreements. Why not build a consulate there? I'm sure your subjects will appreciate you taking care of them, even when they travel outside the kingdom. Shh. Yeah. yeah. Wonderful. I'm glad we'll be taking care of your subjects, even when they're traveling outside the country. She would be. She would. Now I can appoint a diplomat. Yay! But who will be the diplomat? Oh. That's a Shirelle! No, Shirelle's dead. Kimo Tevon gave me that again. Thanks, my dude. Go make a, another random one. Someone will give me a legendary item one day. Please. <laughs> one of those guys has to be tied to the military. Yes. That Look how happen. fat my military is. Ooh, it is fat. So let's uh, <gasps> point us a diplomat. So the treasurer could do it. Um, Who could take his spot? Jubilos, I think. Jubilos or Canara. Um. Or wait, hold up. Lindsay could do that. Can anyone else do this job? No. Jaythal. Oh, Jaythal. How king and be odd, indeed. What What is how to say? Must scroll. But the chaos! What role does the mammoth play in managing your lands and people? Well, it, uh, it contributes to the most important kingdom step. The action economy. <laughs> how to go back here. Support the regente is busy. I'm just gonna pass some days, you know what? Wait, what? I thought we were pointing people. I need to wait for Lindsay to be done with what oh. she's doing. Oh! Oh my. Oh, nice. there's so much stuff going on. I want to turn something into a town, but I can't right now. Which one's gonna become a town, though? That's the... Know. That's the real question. We're just gonna spin the clock a little bit. Man's best friend! <gasps> troll puppies! Yeah! Go get me some troll puppies! 100%. 100% of the time it works all the time. And of course, as a trap, we spent a lot of crisis points on that. Yeah. <laughs> nice, well done, right. oh, dude. Okay, so. We have the Visores. No one can. No one is counseling. Okay. What was it doing again? So far, just passing time, but I think we no, should. No, no, that's not true at all. That's not. No. I was doing. I don't remember what it's called. Oh. Where? Is it in rank up? No. Economy! Yeah, build a town. I was gonna build me a town. Boom! Boom. Woohoo! 39 more days, indeed. Uh. Huh. 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 Come on. We might as well go kill a dragon. No, I'm I got this. I got this. Okay. That's fair. Now I can Yay. which village though? Which town? What happened? I think that you just have to, like, scroll out and rank one of them up. Oh, yeah, I guess that makes sense. Oh. It, sh it should be Trade Guard. That was the first one. Do I see you have Riot Points? Oh, yeah. Also, I have uh, the Invincible Kingdom on right now because I like to cheat. <laughs> because we died one time. Because we died in somewhere we were. We... Uh, dealing with the, the Sightless Sister. Yes. That's not what her name is. The Face Sister. I I'm gonna call her Sightless Sister, though. <laughs> I think it's more accurate. That's fair. Now what are we going to build here? Wow. What's our bad stat? A lot of them. Yes, many. I think we're going to just do stability buildings. Just we're going to hit stability buildings until we're done. I feel like there might be something else that does stabilities. Hello! Oh, maybe not. Jeez. Ah, oh, yes, the jail. Right next to the stocks. Two jails. Perfect. Yeah, that's how it works, my dude. Come on. Exactly. A fort. Sure. Good. Good. And a brothel. Which should help. That makes people nice and super stable. Loyalty, though. We'll do it. One brothel. A walkin! Wait, who are you? Whatever, go there. I thought he already had a shop, but cool. I have some confusions. 
Upgrade. Why not? Do I not have build points? Nope. <laughs> I want to buy bips. I feel like you have none of stuff. No, nah, man, there's so many people. You put them in the stocks. That, that's their, like, their recreation is they go to the stocks and they get they have to play dodgeball in the stocks. It'd be so hard to do. It would really work those, those quads. <laughs> so much clicking. Oh, why is there not a... Do you remember when we wanted to do this individually? Yep. Instead of in intervals of, like, 18, if you could dodge a noose, you could dodge a ball. Uh, <laughs> <coughs> oh, excuse me. 150 is probably not enough. That's what we got. Oh, is this the thing that... Okay, it did work. Neato. All right. Brewery. Can't upgrade. Herbalist house. Alchemist lab. Oh, wait. That's... Bakken's got a shop, finally. Nice. Yay. That crazy old man. Your city management makes me... Cre yeah, I know. <laughs> I was elected to lead. Not to read. Indeed. Tavern becomes an inn. This becomes a nothing. Hooray. What? What are you? Oh, it's the Mastodon. Can I upgrade my Mastodon on the screen, please? That'd be so cool. Oh, I feel like there's something else. There's got to be other things that I've created in my time. I guess not. Oh, well. Off we go, then. Did you read the descriptions? Not really. I'm here to do a fight and advisors. Oh yeah, I still gotta wait a million days. I am trying a lot harder in the LG run to do the kingdom stuff. I just I fell in a really deep hole this time. Ooh. Triumph! This has to oh come on, my dude. Jesus. Failure. We're gonna go, you don't do that. What's this give me? More Kamunata. Sure. You go do that. And yeah, okay, I've done enough for now. Face meat palm. Yes, I know, I'm the worst. I didn't know it'd be difficult, so I skipped all the tutorials and then I game over. <laughs> ah! Ring lady. Hello, ring lady. Nice. Water. Earth. Earth. Fire. Fire. Heart! Fire. Now, see, you are going for Avatar, I was going for Captain Planet. Which is basically Avatar from the 90s. <laughs> but not Asian. Bakken! Oh, Bakken! Yay! A potion of Shield of Faith! Oh, jeez, Bakken! Thank you so much! That's so great! Oh, goody! It's like when you open a really bad sweater from your really nice aunt on Christmas, but it's like, oh, I don't want this. <laughs> I mean, that really bad sweater still gives a plus two deflection bonus, which I no longer need at all. To the square. Because I do have a lot of stuff I want to vendor. Yeah, that's fair. We'll keep the the Dragonbane spear. Yeah, that's real nice. Yes. I think now that I have improved critical on tunes, I think I'm good enough, though. I think. That should tip it. And then, like, the armor with acid resistance and give everybody acid resistance. But don't forget the touch and range touch spells can sneak attack if a target is flanked or flat footed. That will be the CG run, as everyone has some form of sneak attack. That'd be great. Because I'm going to use the turn base mod for that. Yes, Vital Strike is still broken. I don't know if they've patched it. I've seen it originally, it multiplied all the dice. Now I think it just doesn't give you extra dice when you crit. I don't know. I still have a real big strength mod in the times three critical. Yes, there's a turn base mod on Nexus. It's called a. Uh, the angry cat. It's called, I think, just turn-based. It's so good that Owlcat Games themselves posted about it on their social media today. Someone's not happy about that. Ah. Wait, what are... Okay. Oh, whoa. Physical perfection. Yeah, this is... Some of this is Irvetti's. So we gotta be a little slower here. Should we equip people first and then sell? Nah, maybe... It sounds like so much work, so the game is saved. Yay! Yeah, pretty much. Don't need that. Don't need that. What are you? Plus five keen short sword that deals divine damage to invisible. I mean, that's pretty good. Oh, yeah, I remember. We got that when we got the, the punching dagger. It's not really good for anybody, though. 
rogues someday. Not rogues necessarily. I'm talking about the party I'm using right now. Oh, I see what you're saying. I'd yes. rather have the rapier the Javel has. No, that's pretty good for Harem. Have you played the under thing? I'm gonna do the under thing last. Okay. I'm not gonna do all of the under thing, but I'm gonna do the like what story arc there is in the under thing. That's just so weird. I don't what. That's good. Plus five to con and no ring, but you lose your amulet. Still probably worth. Cross a short sword. Dark wind. These are the important ones. I like that they put them next to each other for my convenience. I agree, kind person. Don't need that. We'll take that. I don't know. Why'd that come off? Oh, I have more than one. Nice. Or no, I took it off. Yeah, hold up. You were right. Stop being right on my streams. I don't like it. <laughs> to the equipment! Was that even English? That's yeah, English. I don't know if the Herald Caller is any good. I don't think so. I think the summon list is too small. I think evil summoners can just summon like frost giants at the end of it. Which is not enough. No. That's a, let's put this on. It's very good. And Lindsay was Lindsay! Lindsay! We need to talk about these things! Ah sa 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 sa, yes, in Sinlish I'm angry at you. You already got a headband? Man, there are so many headbands of mental perfect perfection <laughs> just floating around. All right, Dad, congratulations. No, it's gotta be, it's gotta be you, doesn't it? Mm-hmm. More castings of the magic you use. Plus your con. I said even English, but that arc is so good. I need to talk about, yeah, after after the events of uh, the last session of Wrath of the Righteous, yeah. That is definitely a thing we need to discuss. Uh, what was I doing? I'm gonna do this, that, and this to good, and scroll here, and BAM! Very, very, very smart. The smartest. Ring of Evasion. What is this? Uh, bad? Because that doesn't stack. Give it to you. There you go. Very good. So happy for you. Ring of Chaos! Freedom of movement's not- no, we're gonna leave the freedom of movement on her. I need more Fs to press. Yeah, that was- Wrath of the Righteous is a really mean adventure path. That's what I'll say. But anyway, this is a plus five Agile Shock Scimitar. I think I like this. Why can't I use that? What? I didn't know Short Sword was a martial weapon. Fair enough. It's not, though! Short swords are simple. Maybe they are. I don't I think know. they are martial. Yeah, I just the classes like that use simple weapons use them, so I don't mm -hmm. really think about it. The Arbiter's Robe, which is nothing for us. Hooray. Somebody's got to equip Shall that. Who doesn't have a, a nice, fat con buff? Your great king! No, oh, your great king, actually. That's kind of crappy equipment. Hold up. <laughs> your great king's been hobbled this whole time. Put this on, my dude. I've had that for so long since the Torog stuff. God, God, Woo! I'm good at this game. No one can tell me otherwise. <laughs> now where's the the Pirates of Dark Water here? <laughs> oh, God, I guess that'll go here, and that'll go here. Which I lose some armor class, but I get a really big con buff, which means Harem won't go down. Hmm. So I would not have a ring of protection? But, wait. I don't like Harem near as much. Because I like Regongar. He's just a better friend of mine. Reggie is the best. And he's already got D12 hit dice. You're leading a ring of protection on him, though. Just plus four, I think. Oh, no, it's plus five. It's one of the big ones. One of them big fat rings. And Lindsay was called forth! Ring of Regeneration, or... Can I take off your plot ring? No. Nope. I 
thought she started crying. Jeez, Lindsay. It's perhaps a, a tad extreme of a reaction. Nah, it's Lindsay. It's not extreme enough. I don't believe it. I'm having a lot of problems believing that reaction. Okay, good enough. Well, maybe we could... Oh, no, Amiri has a different thing that's adding to her deflection bonus. Just kidding. Yeah, she's got a... I forget. But a thing for sure. Citizen. Dog. God. Horse. Alright, we'll go kill that dragon. It's gonna be the best ever. Hail to the king! They are my friends. Best friends. And I'll kill them if they say otherwise. I still wanna play Kingmaker IRL. I really do. As, as we come to what I assume is the very end of the game, at this point, like, I think there's a lot missing that you, like, you can't really get without, like, tabletop Kingmaker. Not that I'm mad that they did Kingmaker. No, I think that overall it's a really cool adventure path to pick just because it's got so many mechanics. And there's just, there's a lot of, I won't say improvisation, that's wrong, but you know what I mean, right? Mm -hmm. The game can only have so many options. And a lot of those options aren't. So are you not mad that Skull Island did not use Hail to the King as a side? I didn't, <laughs> I didn't watch it, to tell you the truth. I haven't seen a King Kong movie since, like, God, that long. I'm gonna go meet Octavia's mama. We'll do that first. This is not the fastest way. Apparently it is. Apparently... No. That should have definitely been the fastest way. I'm starting to question the speed of things. To the Verdant Chambers! Oh, maybe it has us go around the woods, because it takes us so long to get through the woods. I don't understand why it does. Several I mastodons. Be nice. Don't you think? We'll rest me. Actually, I'm gonna, I'm gonna send Lindsay away here in a second. Oh yeah, because I'll do you. I need a bit of a switch. Send out you. Oh, grab Octavia. Ooh. And... I WONDER WHERE TO GO! Hmm. Hmm. Mommy, yes, Octavia's mom is dead, too. Yeah, everyone died. Text burned to the ground. This is a prime example of more why- strength. Thanks. Of why you need more freedom to make a game like this work. You wish to see the Marchioness? I wish to open this door. What a bother. Oh, God. Oh, no. Oh, wait, wait, wait. We Dropping Lindsay, Lindsay was a bad idea. Uh, ah, yeah, this is sketch. Hello, what is happen? Marchioness. It's not even a word. Marchioness Clarida da Fiorni. What is it? I wasn't expecting guests. A woman comes out of the back rooms in a dress that was once expensive but is now moth eaten and heavily mended. Her posture and gait give way noble upbringing. She seems to be in her forties, though some pain or suffering must have worn her beyond her years, leaving wrinkles across her face and gray in her hair. I am the Marchioness Clarida, Clarida della Fiorni. Welcome to my manor. I'm afraid I have nothing to offer you, nor do I have the honor of knowing you. To what do I have the pleasure? I am your king! Oh. Hello. Mother? Uh, Octavia? Gods! My Octavia, is it really you? It has been so many years! The Marchioness steps forward to hug her daughter, tears in her eyes, but she stops when she sees Octavia's stony gaze. Your Octavia? Your? My last memory is of you selling me to slave traders, and you dare call me yours? Cruel words, but fair. Octavia, my child, let me tell you what happened. Afterwards, you may decide your, uh, on your own what to do, even if it means you never wish to see me again. All I need is to be I have to be happy is to know you are safe and sound. I'm listening. Who was daddy? A pathetic wretch and nothing more. A visiting elf swept a silly young girl off her feet and then vanished as soon as he learned she was expecting. I care not to even say his name. Can we have some weird headcanon that it was two moons? <laughs> yes. I could be a hundred years older than my daughter who's been hitting on me this whole time. Oh, now it's why. really chaotic evil. That's why we're killing everyone to repress the badness. So two moons won't go with him. Well, at least he made one good thing in his life, right? 
Aw, Ragongar, the... that's so sweet. There are por- potions for those who don't wish to have children. They aren't expensive. Octavia's voice is sharp and cold. Especially not for someone living in a mansion. <sighs> and what would I have done then? What would I do without you? Aww. Reg, don't. Not now. How do slave happen? My father, may his soul rest in peace, was a very stern man. Some would say cruel. When he found out I was expecting the child of some adventure, he expelled me from the house and cut me off from my inheritance. I scraped by on my own for three years, sewing and a teaching and the like. But then my father discovered he was dying, and the Delafiorni line would end, so he told me he would leave, leave the full inheritance to me if I would only get rid of my disgrace. Get rid of you. And so you did. Trade me for an inheritance, I see. Nobility, to be sure. Rugongar spits on the clean floor. My dude. Reasonable. Shut up, Jadel! <laughs> no, it wasn't like that at all. I, I had a plan to deceive him, you know. I made arrangements with a man from the Technic League. He was supposed to take you to Numeria, keep you there until my father died, and then bring you back. I was trying to do what I thought was best for you. Do you understand? I wanted you to grow up in your own manner, in luxury rather than poverty. But once father was gone, the man from the Technic League said he didn't remember any such arrangements. He said he bought you and had already sold you and had no idea where you were anymore. Why didn't you buy her back? I had no idea where she was. Octavia, believe me, I continued to look for you all these years. I spent all of the inheritance hiring sleuths and investigators to scour Numeria and the River Kingdoms for you. But you were nowhere to be found. So the big hole there is she's a cabinet member of the kingdom with the strongest military in the River Kingdoms. See how that might, like, uh, like, that's who you are. That's a thing that we can see. Mm Mm-hmm. The Marquina wipes tears from her eyes. I knew you were still alive. I could feel it. And I never stopped searching. I just wanted to see you again. Just once. At least to beg your forgiveness. What do you say, Octavia? I say I can't understand how this woman has the nerve to snivel and play the innocent victim. Quit the drama, mommy dear. You seem to have lived well enough all these years. You used me like a chip at the gambling house and you lost. And once you changed your mind and tried to get me back, it was too late. Well, too bad. Am I supposed to feel sorry for you? No, my child. I was young and stupid. I thought I could make a better life for you. I never needed the title or even this townhouse. You didn't, did you? Is that so? Well then, just let me spare you of it. A smirk disfigures Octavia's face, or maybe rather a grimace of pain. She tears an oil lamp from the wall and hurls it to the floor. I think my girl's earning a spot in the party. Mm-hmm. Look Look at her oh go. Oh my god. Heck! Octavia, my dear child, don't! Ah! Well, we didn't kill her, so I'm a little upset about that. I... Um... Uh... The house is burning to the ground. That lady is very dead. No, she ran to the back where it's safe. I alt tab. Nope, nope, we're looting. Your wish granted. I guess hang on a second. <laughs> we have things for this. We're level 16. Yeah, we do not care about anything that's happening right now. Now, let's loot the house. Where there's nothing. God. Of course there would be nothing, but one has to check. She is broke. Paintings are for selling! (laughs) They try so hard. How about this room? This seems like a room of objects and items. Perhaps for me to have? Blah! Whatever. Alright, fine. So I wonder if she reacts differently. If if she was still chaotic good. Mm -hmm. And Ragongar had gone to CN, probably. Yeah. Yeah. So yeah, I kind of wonder how they would both react differently to their respective situations. So I guess we have to have two magi in that party, which is not strictly speaking the worst problem in mm-hmm. your life. Zap! <laughs> okay. Give him the zats. Give him the zats. Actually, there's another magus build I want to use. My strength that, uh, betrays me. I forget the. Um, when you burn some lady's house down. I forget the the <laughs> name of the feat exactly, but you have to be able to cast spells from the druid list. I think the druid list. Yeah. And, uh, 
Because I need to go talk to Octavia. Oh. I can't do that right now, apparently. Anyway, as I was trying to say, you need Druid spells and Vital Strike. And when you do cold damage and Druid spells with Vital Strike, you can stagger people. So that's like the other big damaging Magus build. One day. I need to catch my breath. Are you competent? How much, how far behind are you? Pretty darn, pretty darn. What did I even level you as when I needed to quickly throw stuff on you? You're an arcane trickster. That's not so bad. She's one of the ones that would, we need to use the mod to retrain if she was gonna stick around though. Yeah. Bad stats are really bad. All right, back to the house. Back to the throne room, I. Now we'll go kill us a dragon. Ooh. A dragon! I saw a dragon! Shut up, mother. Used to be able to quote that. Because I made a lot of alts in Skyrim. Because Skyrim is wonderful. I think Octavia's in the back. So next Octavia! To the winged man's. Octavia stands beneath the tr tree, uh, looking once again at the figure. Wait. It's a stone tree. <laughs> With Della Fiori's coat of arms. Well then, no more mysteries. I know who I am now. Octavia hurls the fibula down from the viewing point. Uh, we were definitely supposed to talk to her outside. <laughs> I'm Octavia. Just Octavia. An orphan without a family. Reg, you, Lindsay. Our crazy team is my true family. And I don't need any other. I don't understand why you spared her. You should have let her burn with the house. Maybe, but let her live. Let her carry the memory of what she's done and the knowledge that I'll never forget it to her death. That's punishment enough for her. And after what we did at the Technic League's hideout, I don't want to kill again without need. I mean, I'm sure it was the right decision. It's just, you know, I'm afraid of turning into a monster or walking over a trail of corpses. Octavia smiles mischievously. It's easier to live without the past. But with, that, with no past, only the future lies ahead. So lead the way. Whatever awaits us, I'm with you to the end. Oh. Yay. Team of friend. Brains. I think I might leave Lindsay behind to take Octavia. What's that? I don't know. Who are we about to give all the trickery ranks to? I mean, we would... I would have to take a quick pause for the cause, turn on a mod, because I refuse to take that on anything. Oof. Ever. Ever. But then she would be an eldritch, uh... God, I never remember the name of that archetype. Rogue archetype, cast like a magus, so casts arcane spells and has sneak attack, and can become an arcane trickster from one class. And probably just go that route, because there's... I've seen some, some pretty good... Especially with how Sneak Attack works in Kingmaker builds for Arcane Tricksters, you get like Scorching Ray. And that's like, each one of those is doing Sneak Attack damage. Hmm, that's fair. I don't know though, what do you think? Should we run Lindsay all the way? I like Lindsay. That feels weird. What? Track Disciple 10, I guess I'll take my 6th Magus level. You're gonna FORCE ME TO DO IT! Fine, jeez. Any of these odd? Nah, so we're just gonna... Oh, that one's odd, duh. <laughs> I know how math works and you can't prove otherwise. Hey, you're my, my face. My big, ugly, orcish face. He's clearly a very charming orcish face. No. No. <laughs> no. I've got you! <laughs> mm. What do I take? Just make somebody flat-footed. Seems good. And some heckin' new spells. Woo! Oh, jeez. Haste, slow. I'm now gonna take Fireball. Yeah. Because it kind of doesn't matter right now. And then two level five spells. Are any of these touch spells? Snick. Fire Snick. Huh. I don't mm -hmm. take that one. And we'll take Baleful Polymorph, which I'll never use, but we're gonna have it. Huh. The A train levels, Jathel levels. Eggs. She's got to do the same thing I did. Ooh, Actually, hang so on. So would improved critical get her? What's my primary weapon right now? Probably that. 
carrying a lot of stiff. A lot of stiff. Almost all of it has a 20 crit range, though. She had a falchion for a while, but I got rid of it for this glaive. 19 to 20 times 3. Worth it for a feat? I don't think so. The extra 5% crit chance isn't worth it for you? What would we get from a barbarian level? That's fair. That's a fair We'd question. get DR. Also, like, not the, the, the greatest thing ever. Be real nice against that dragon. That's true. The thing with, like, five or six attacks. Yeah, that's true. That's when DR really starts to shine. All right, fine. I'm not super happy about it, baby. Okay. I'll learn to forgive myself with time, I'm sure. What? Oh, fine. I forgot my 10 intelligence is making me do that. Think. Think. And Jathel. JJ the jet plane. It's another good name for Jathel. I think she's the only one making those. Okay, so, bit of real talk here. I guess it's not real talk, but it's important. Okay. Lindsay's Macedon's broken. That's true, and that was one of the primary reasons we were keeping her in the party. Was just so she would be somebody else to up the action economy. I like Lindsay. I don't know if I like her for this arc. Yeah, this Is run. She's definitely just, like, been pooped upon at every possible turn. Yeah. I don't know. I'm I'm genuinely torn. Because Octavia I, has earned some serious cool points. Yeah, that was pretty sweet, what she did. I... God, I'm at a loss. I really am. I don't know if I want to just run with Lindsay for what remains of the game. Are we going to run with Lindsay in any other game? Yeah. We have to. Well, we don't have to, but she can't go away. Right. So, like, she's in the LG run. She'll be in the CG run. Lindsay's going to be there all the time. <laughs> if Lindsay's going to be there all the time... I then... have too many questions! Oh, no! This is hard! Uh, well, first things first. Let me remember to put this back on Radongar because it got dropped at some point. Hold on to that, my guy! Probably when we're giving him a million potions. Yeah, probably. Why are you leveling her up if we have to... Yeah, because we're going to retrain her from jump because yes. her con is horrible. It's so bad. I definitely can't take some of the 9 con out, even with a plus 6 con belt. No. Look how many hit points she has. She dies. Oh my She's god. Just, something's going to like burp at her and she falls over. That's why I didn't use her in the first place. But mm -hmm. I could retrain her. Hmm. Do we want to taint the no mods run? That's fair. Okay, yeah. No mods means Octavia's unplayable. I think that's that's fair. Yes, I agree. Eight so, con is so bad. It's not enough. You can't. Like, that's heinous. You could play an eight con barbarian. It would be not the best, but you have stuff to buff it in-house and a high hit dice. Yes. But a arcane trickster... Nah. You can't do it. You smell that. Well, I'm gonna... Humana, humana, humana. Lindsay, it's still so long. I'm gonna. Run Wait, that. Is, is Octavia actually doing that? Not anymore. Perfect. Alright, Regent. Do your dance, do your dance, do your dance quick. <laughs> Walking shall serve the king! Nice. Oh. Court alchemist. Yes! Did that happen? What? I have a confusion. Arrears. Arrears? Oh, wait, I know what that means. That means they didn't pay their taxes. Go get their taxes! Use Chris's points! You are indefensible! That, those are words. Yes. Extraordinary goods from the black market? Hey! Oh, I didn't want you to do that. It keeps randomly assigning them to stuff. It's really making me mad. Yeah, I don't like it. Whatever, it's fine. It con arcane trickster is... Ah, uh, is an arcane trickster a d6 or a, a d, uh, no, hold on. I, can... I thought arcane trickster was a d8. I think it's a d6. Oh my god, Hang is on. it really? That's just, arcane trickster. Should say somewhere right here, right? 
You, that would that would track. Please, please tell me how many hit points. My God. Well, that's a little silly. That is rough. Doesn't even tell you here. Whatevs. I'm googling it. I think it's a D6. I could be wrong. I think they're a D6. Point is, the amount of hit points is not high enough. Yes. She just gets killed. Every time. We're gonna rest. I don't know if we need it or not. Now we're going dragon hunting. Dragon hunting, dragon hunting. Don't look at dragon hunting. So I will run with her in the chaotic good run. Yeah. And Bergongar is gonna be a very different man in that run. I'm I'm super excited for the chaotic good run because we're gonna get to see like the other side of their little arc. I do like Ragongar. Yes, I love Reg. Whoa! One thing everything I... changed. Why did it change? Well, the Fire Nation attacked. Oh, do I have to click on this specific? Go away. Um. Anyway, sorry, my dude. We're taking Lindsay. Socks or Macedon's broken. Hopefully it, it spawns in, like, the appropriate places. Mm -hmm. So maybe when she levels next, she just starts leveling as a bard. Google says D6. That's what I thought. It is a D6. Because I've oh only ever theory God. crafted the Arcane Trickster. Because the Arcane Trickster looks, like, not the best. And it's kind of one of the reasons. Fortunately, with those mods, there's nothing saying she stays on those classes anyway. Truth. All right. Gonna go kill us a dragon over at the dragon's house. Ilthuliax Lair. Not as good a name as, as a, a name I still don't remember. God, I said it earlier. You did. The Lopsix. It's a better dragon name. It's my favorite dragon name. It's a pretty good dragon name. It has to sound like a, like a cross between some kind of like rainforest insect and an evil 1980s wizard. Would be nice it's fine. They make up for being killed with one crit and level 16 plus by having those handy dandy cantrips. Oh. <laughs> I guess you are doing a lot of sneak attacks. Do you have permanent wisdom, Jane? Oh, Mary. I've been ignoring you for an amount of time. We got mad after we couldn't romance you. We're so sorry. Yeah, that's, that's weird. I guess on the one hand, I'm like, sure, that's neat. It doesn't force every single NPC to, like, all of them are bisexual and you may do with them as you will. But also, like, my choices are to join an open relationship, split up an open relationship, or Tristan. Or Valerie. Boring. It's, I won't say boring, I will say... Tristan and Valerie are pretty vanilla wafers. Yeah, that's a good way to say it. What am I doing? Scrolls. See, like, I, I get if not every single am character is romanceable. Right Fair. Right. But, like, only four of them? It's a little weird. And, like, what if I want to romance a lady? There's yeah. no, like, good evil option. I should have guessed that this unbearable Tangle pose of the DC, it works amazing. It's a little among Aravetti's guards. I remember being sickened by his verses even back at the Academy. For the life of me, I can't understand it. Was he really that crazy about Aravetti? Or was he so used to licking his boots that he couldn't straighten up even before his death? Look at Reg and Lindsay getting along. I do like Regongar, though. I love Regongar. Some of it's a little, like, there are people in the party who should have turned their noses up at Regongar, but I like Regongar. Yes. I don't think he's... <laughs> I get why he is the way he is. I'm sure, is he a little... Chaotic evil? Yeah, yeah. Exactly. All right. It's time to go fight us a dragon. Little punching. Monk bard. <laughs> Little punching. Wouldn't be the worst uh, way to run. Uh, scaled fists for charisma to AC and then bard the rest of the way. Mm -hmm. Buff yourself out. Or like the battle dancer of 3 5. You better quit that. I'm so sorry. Alright, so does it drop me right in the cave? It doesn't. Uh, no. Oh, Go. I thought I did. Nice. Well, three Macedons are moving. Okay, I'm fine with this now. Oh, thank God. Do I have... Show me the bacon! Okay, cool. Okay, so, wow, yeah, if it breaks again, just remove Lindsay from the party and bring her back. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we need to switch out armor. We need that spear. I'm kind of thinking about... something. 
I don't have to retrain with a mod. But I can retrain it in Noriel. And the first one's free. But I can't change archetypes. Never mind. I was going to be like, so what if two wins in a mirror were mad dogs? What if they had mad <laughs> <laughs> We can do this! But I can't retrain Amiri's archetype. I could retrain two moons. Uh, Next time I go back to the kingdom, we'll do it. I'm gonna fight the dragon first, and then I'll have myself a fourth mastodon. Have yourself a fourth mastodon. <laughs> <laughs> Break the action economy. So who gets the, the spear, though? Mm. Right, we just gave two moons a feat. That means you should not take Not it. Definitely not. Two moons has the, the raw damage output. Harem? Why not? I think it's gotta be harem. Everybody else has a better weapon. Question mark. Here's another person who needs to take improved critical. Yeah, I go to the ring was go to Frodo. Oh, it's so spanny. Spanny. That's what it is, my dude. And we're gonna equip the Durgan armor to your boy! It still looks really cool. Does. The, like, short skirt's kind of weird for me. Who wears short skirts? We do it my way. And here's some <laughs> shiny gold armor for you, my dude. Ooh, great. All right. And we're gonna... Whoop. Are we gonna buff? Or are we gonna wait? No, we don't need case? buffs. We're gonna just... Trapping our good mistress with shortest letters! Strangers! Strangers run! Stranger danger! Flees into dungeon. Alright. I forget what my buffs look like. It's. There are so many anymore. There are. Yes. I'm still, I'm still here. Here. Let's start with the, the Mastodons. Pro energy. Oh. Choosing acid. Yes. Unless this dragon, like, cycles its element. That'd be rude. That would be so rude. But, it's a black dragon. But, it does acid damage. But pretty good. Like replace it with like a like a blue dragon <laughs> out of nowhere. That would be so mean. It would stop metagaming, let me tell you what. I'm gonna go really slow. That's fair. Because I think I have all the time in the world. <laughs> I'm so glad that fixed and I have my buddy back. How bad I didn't have all my, all my dogs. I'm about to have another one too. Yenimosi Travisi! Okay, cool. Neato. And then animal growth. Which still doesn't make you bigger. I'm salty. I really am. I yeah. really, really am. <laughs> and legendary proportions. You gotta enunciate harder for those higher level spells. Yenimosi Travisi! Sorry, I'm just trying to do the right effects. So you're I, just getting more serious. I want everybody to know what's up. And this is the nice piece. Share your will. Share your mass bull strength. Share your mass cat's grace. Oh my, she's so much angrier. Someone has mass stone skin. Harem does. Was lost in thought. Or communal stones again. Also good. Wada Hadayaga! Baba Yaga! Oh no, no. <laughs> Baba Yaga. <laughs> Never did see the first Ant Man. The entrails near. Sorry, I know that's super random. It is, but also, Ant Man's West. pretty good. Was it? Yeah, I yeah. liked it a lot. It was. I like the funnier superhero movies better that don't take themselves so seriously. Yeah, I suppose that's the arc you have to go with eventually. Well, yeah, like, we're just so inundated with them. It's just like, how am I supposed to take this seriously? Just letting me that's intro. fair. Sure. Sure. I mean, no one doesn't want an enlarge person. Can I enlarge Ragongar still? I can't, right? No, I guess I can. Not, not a Jathal. The first one's only good if you pay attention to what's going on. Yeah, fair enough. So I need to show up to the theater very under the influence. And I'll enjoy myself. That's what I'm hearing here. And Mage Armor. Mage Armor. Omer de Mage. Eslo Axi. Yach. Eslo Axi. Yes. 
so I'm curious. That puts my Mastodon now at a grand total of 52 on the armor class. <gasps> it has no items. That is so spicy. 42 oh strength. <laughs> oh, lardy. Ooh, oh, lardy. Sucks. What are such big boys? Anything is possible. Anything is possible when you have such big boys. That's what she said. What? It's funny. <laughs> Nom er orama. A reckoning. I like how the dragon's being so kind. It forced a lot of situations and it makes sense to have them. Just have fun action scenes. You kids and your fun action scenes. How dare you have fun with action scenes? Mirror image. And I guess I appreciated that at the time because we weren't used to the shrinking, like, uh, growing size thing yet. And so it was still, like, novel. And they did a lot of cool things with it. But Gongar is casting that as a swift action. I don't want you to do that. Oh well. I guess I can't differentiate. When she did say that, but not to me. Oh, sorry, Dexter. Well, there goes all my quick and meta magic spells. Oops. Oh well. It is what it is. Big ups to this dragon for letting us have many, many, many buffs. Seriously. Just sitting there. After her kobolds have seen us. What troubles, you? troubles me is the meta. Already. Yeah, right. All the barbarians waiting for buffs to get done ticking. No one stands in my way. Oh, are you done saying your fancy words yet? Adventures call. I mean, with my with my acid stuff on me, that doesn't really affect me. Medium sized Lindsay! Have her sneak. This for I don't think she has to. And Lindsay was called for. Who am I hanging up on? I'm pretty sure I can just run up here. Those effects are freaky. Yeah. Please. God, she's so enormous. And Giant halflings are creepy. There's one over here, too, I think. Lindsay's a bad one. No, she doesn't. I wrote it like I saw it. Lindsay. Moonsy! Moonsy? <laughs> What's his new name? It's like Topsy from the King of the Hill. Boss, please. Flopsy. Let's move already. Now we missed one. Oh well, they can't damage me. You deserved it. Let's so see if we can make this go really No, it's a green to paralysis, damn. I was gonna just say, eh, hold monster. Yeah, protect from answer, but I feel like I've been subject to it. <laughs> well said, Ben. A hungry pit! Falling in the pier, yeah! You fell in him. You slightly moved over from the pier. Gonna well, kill- actually, What? What might be nice is for Lindsay to start pitting all those kobolds that are, like, shooting at you and gonna attack you and stuff. But they don't do anything. They're just being heckin' rude boys. Okay. Heckin' rude boys! Get mad! <laughs> Profane Nimbus! I don't know what that means. Viewer, stop it. I feel like the only way I can really hurt this thing is with... Is if it has a bunch of stuff on it. It does. Where are you at, my dude? Well, you could slow it because it's hasted. It's hasted? I think so. I think I saw that. Oh, I forgot to haste us! Ah, jeez! Lindsay! 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 Haste! Also do a sing! Haste! Huste! Those are all the names of the spells, the right ones. I don't know if I can even hit Lil Fluliac. It's real big. 58. Yeah, I think what I gotta do is I gotta just spam my breath weapon. <laughs> and then, like, fireballs. I think that's how we... Yep, I think that's that's not even a big dragon! You're fine. It's fine. Yeah, I got this. We got this. You. You make a point. I do have a, a small concern. I know I can't paralyze a dragon. My charisma is really good. Mm-hmm. It's not immune to that. Apparently it is. Why would it... Is it immune to mind affecting? My guess. That's not right. That's That's not how that works. It's been a while since I ran a dragon. They're not immune to mind affecting, sleep and paralysis. Oh well, it is what it is. 
I'm gonna keep just vomiting acid up your butt. Here we go. Somebody got a You better stop your caustic eruptions. I'm not a fan. Oh, we got it. No, nice. out. Ha <laughs> ha! That was so easy because it let us buff so much. La 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 looks like a giant stove cold, but I really like that. He does. Release the peeps! A thousand bips. Yeah, that's exactly how it happened in Neverwinter Nights 2, was there's a bunch of treasure, but depending on how well you'd set up, like, crossroad keep and stuff, was how much got back to the keep. Mm -hmm. Same idea. Thank you. I swear to God. Boss, please. Okay. An elven curb blade. Save real quick. Look at all that non-magical gear. You're very sparkly. So I feel like I got gypped. Is that just me? <laughs> this right there. We go. There we go. We got us a weird wall. It's like Wonder Wall. Ooh, that'll be sweet for Valerie. Plus five tower shield, grants its wielder plus four bonus saving throws against dragon stuff and basically against dragon stuff. Gentle persuasion. What? <laughs> Upon performing a good deed, the armor reduces wearer's cons by two each time and one. Only committing the elect, fight for thief. And equipment armor is only possible, so it's cursed armor. Drow worshippers of Nauticula created this armor to do some severe and elven here of Saren Ray. Uh, yeah. No one's really sneaking at all. So, whatever. Don't care about that. Void mirror. That's sweet. Well, that's gonna be the one that saves you. This was for. That's kinda neat, but mostly. Let's loot the dragon. What you got? You foodly lack. Skip it! Versus armor plus seven. Felt the physical perfection plus eight. Hey! You can't go that high! Technically, you can, using the crafting rules. Mm. Just the belts of the physical perfection and all the belts and headbands are just things that they have made as examples, technically, from the item crafting rules. So you could send it to 24 if you had the time. Who has the time? We has the time. I mean, it's our kingdom. Sit and wait three years. I gotta make this thing. Hold up! But where is it? Hold on. Hello! Magic belt! Plus ocho! Huh. Yes! And you got me. You need a little more con in your life. CON! <laughs> Alrighty. Anything else? I guess let's loot all those little buddies. So, I feel like that was supposed to help me in the upcoming fight against old girl. But I didn't really get much of anything. I think it was just supposed to be like an independent little... New decree. The kingdom is on hold. Please stand by. <laughs> we have to shut down the government while our item crafters, our top item crafters, are making stuff. I should probably level up my father. Druid 15. Feels good. Ooh. More search, restore in vain. I can summon Elder Elementals. I don't know what that is, but Dita. The old Frightful old aspect boys. is fun. Stormbolts is fun. Sea Mantle is pointless. I guess not, he had Sea Mantle on him. Sunburst is fun. More importantly, my Mastodon is a little stronger. Excellent. Your life ebbs. It's already dead and really glowy. So pretty. Every time I see Paizo's Black Dragon, I always get a little sad because I. One of the things I think Watsi did better was the Black Dragon. It's, it's here's a here's a fun thing. We actually have a bit of a collector's item here at the house, and he sits we right do. right behind my monitor. He's a little pointy, and sometimes his Azazel chews on him. His name is Tim. His name is Tim. Tim's pretty expensive. Tim is so cool. I one of these days, the we're going to go to Gen Con and we're going to get the red one. And we got to get. I remember when we went to Gen Con last year, they had like dragon heads and mind flare heads and stuff on like mounts on the wall mm -hmm. as if you had slewed it. So cool. I need the black dragon one now. 
Y'all seen it. Y'all have borne witness to my abject violence. And I can't, why can't I rest here? There's nothing here. Uh, it's too small. Can't be done. God. Too acidy. Oh, speaking of that, we should probably change some gear around. Oh, yeah. Should change back into our, our slightly I... better for other occasions stuff. Why did I... Well, it's a communal thing. Two minutes had to get it anyway. That's what she said. Yeah. Too acid. It's too acidic. Can't sleep here. <laughs> I'm really glad that this is starting to maybe come to an end. I've enjoyed it, but like... One of my favorite things about being a YouTuber, and I've realized this now that the Steam sale is, like, full on, and I take a looky-loo at that. That armor just looks cooler. I can justify beating video games and, like, spending time to play said video games, which is pretty sweet. Not that I, like, want it to end, but I've had the time to be like, I'm gonna play Kingmaker three hours a week. So we go to the Castle of Kniefs. Ooh. I'll go to the Castle of Kniefs. Go ahead and clear all three of these. They're supposed to help me in my fight with Old Girl. Do I know when that's happening, also? I still need to find Akundia. Akundia really wants to hear about that. So, that's all cleared out. Next development in 27 days. So we have a month to screw around, basically. I really wish I could see those random encounters. Yeah, that's definitely, like, a pretty good mod. I'm really hungry. When we go to the store, do you want to stop at, like, Taco Bell or something? Sure. Well, hello, big Earth Elemental. Oh, man, you big Earth Elemental. I got 99 problems with these Earth Elementals. That's pretty accurate. Oh, you're sundering my armor! You're suddenly a problem! Hey! Stop that! That's expensive! You no. Know. Poo poo. Sit. Sit. Oh, the weak suffer. The Earth Elementals suffer more. Loot them. Run them through! Now I guess I don't get their rocks. Boo. Nappy time. No one. No one's got anything to say. Rangar shouts into the void. Mastodons all gather around for a nice campfire tale. <laughs> Tell us the story about when you killed the dragon. Two moons. I don't know why the Mastodons talk like that. They don't either, and stop questioning me. Off we go. Obligatory. How close to level am I? I mean, for someone who just leveled at high level play, that's that's a pretty big jump. That is. Because that never happens. Well, I guess I just killed an Elder Black Dragon. Yeah. That was pretty easy when I had buffed through it and then used AoEs instead of trying to hit an armor class that was too high for me to hit. Yeah. Which is why, maybe in Aja's game, you know, maybe in the LG game I want to turn on the, the turn-based mod. Because, like... I don't want Akundio to be an archer, because I'll have to babysit him, mm -hmm. and I'll turn around and there'll be five guys on him, and he'll die, and I had no ability to see that coming because I'm micromanaging like like Tristan. Yeah. Say, a turn-based thing that doesn't happen. That's true. I think I'm gonna give it a shot. This will be the vanilla one. Nothing weird here. Just a bunch of dogs. A Didn't bunch have to bother him. hair is tangled. Oh, time to shave. No. No. <laughs> Can't do that. The hair. Nah, it's like one of the few things in my life I'm super proud of. I have a pretty cool YouTube channel and long hair. <laughs> and I learned today, if you go to Chipotle and you get the quesadilla with brown rice and double fajitas, it tastes like pizza. Didn't it? It was really good. It did taste a little bit like pizza. I was sort of surprised. Should have had it when it was warmer because it had more of the like melty, gross pizza mm. aesthetic. You know what I mean? The cheese stretch. When you get that two week off uh, between this camp and the next, this is where I I'll bring it. it to you warm. Mm. Did you like that better or worse than the bowl also? Um, I probably like the bowl better, but that's mostly for like nutritional purposes. Sure. Something that's not just cheese and bread. <laughs> 
So many noodles. Something that's not just cheese and bread. Yes, yeah, something that's not just cheese and bread. Gotcha. Why did I have a problem on this map before? I don't remember. Ugh. One damage was enough to kill. Guess I don't take their skins. Is that a didgeridoo? There is definitely a didgeridoo. Yeah, it's just that noise. Hey! Oh, it's a wyvern. For me. I can't do anything about Nito. What is happening here? I forget. Did we ever even come here? Or no, did we, we didn't. Turn we, around? We've gone to both. Crit for 161. Well, let's actually, let's see how they fix that. If they fix that. One second, everyone. Um. They didn't. I'm multiplying all my vital strike dice still. Yikes. Nice. That's not how that works at all. Will you stop that? Who? Oh, wait. Oh, this is where we talk to Shika. Yeah, I remember that now. Because mm. this is where these guys are. And oh, all... right, and then we died horribly. Your grave runner did be so you broke it. Now. Really? Nearly which you seek aid from pathetic creatures? Those are the mind gains on me, worm face. I know they all meant yes. We did nothing of the sort, crown. This time we're actually going to watch. Yeah. Because it hurt. It did hurt. Because there's three Astrodanes. Oh my god. What are those even? Elder purple worms, which aren't attached to the ground. Well, the Something off. just got finger of death. Oh. Ooh, hang out. What are you? Oh, is that a purple worm under the ground? Oh wow, that's purple. Yeah, oh my god, it is. Woo! That's terrifying. All right, Shika. Do you want to? Can we talk, Shika? There we go. Hello, children. A uh, figure before you wears gray robes, yet the body beneath them flickers, changing age, race, gender. One moment an ancient elven man, man the next a young hunting a human woman. Oh gosh, I can talk today. Then a tattooed dwarf, and so on. They raise an eyebrow. Well, did you get it for us? Get what for you? Oh, that's right. You don't know about that yet, do you? Honestly, we don't know how you people can handle only moving one way through time. <laughs> <clears throat> but that's besides the point. We need you to retrieve the first crown for us. I'll do it. Excellent. We'll be here when you return. I think we're done. Uh, okay. Because we've heard all this already. Oh, yeah, that's true. This is why I don't have lackeys. They're so messy. But who hasn't actually deadly blown something up in a fight? Am I right? Shaika seems a little shifty. Look at those fishes. They're crumbs and chakra sand. Yeah, that's very good. Smell. Okay, so I'm just gonna look around this specifically. Watch like this purple I worm have it. Me. Whoa! What? When did two moons get perma blinded? Whoa. Battles a waste. Whoa, 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 my dude. Hold up. I have way too many scrolls for this to be an issue. I've had way too many scrolls for this to be an issue for, like, most of the game. That's true. Where am I keeping my scrolls? Here we go. Which one helps with eyeballs? Scroll of remove eyeballs. Wait. <laughs> wait. No. <laughs> it's the, the opposite. opposite of that. Indeed. Over there! Ooh, an item. How did you even see it, two moons? He smelled it. He's only taking a small neck no with really high perception. That's true. Way. Being blind's not that big of a problem for him. Ooh. An ancient elven poop. Are you really an ancient elven poop? <laughs> I would know. I'm an ancient elven poop. No, come on. so many red caps. These were scary, I guess. I like it a lot. I mean, they're still hurting me. Enough. Fair enough. Little rude things. Five rogue levels. That's not bad. Yeah. Get a bunch of them, sneak attack roots. Up. Another token of the dryad. I'm so happy I'm still getting those. Into the castle, gonna save my game now. I remember dying real bad when I came here. Gonna go this way. Hello, trees. Where's my crown? Do a scroll. 
Bonnie. We do it my Bonnie. Chase the Bonnie. Oh, oh my. Uh, Kill all big dogs. Can I fight you? What are you fighting? Uh, we don't get closer. I don't want to pick a fight with an elder purple worm no. if I could avoid it. I was just trying to break down my wall. Oh, interesting. It seems a little purple worm smashed the pillar during the battle, breaking the crown shards loose from the stone above. Oh, interesting. I'm glad they're not attacking us. Not the worst living siege engine, I suppose. In a clearing ahead, a satyr uh, curses and hacks angrily the stone pillar, trying to chip free a piece of a crown embedded incongruous, inc incongruously in its surface. Around him, a massive purple worm rolls and uh, breach in the churned earth. He turns your direction. What? Who are you? No, wait. I don't care. Just get lost. There are plenty of lingering traces of magic from the battle between the wriggling, the wriggling man and the gnarly witch. However, the piece of the first crown shines brighter than any of them. It's obvious that the first crown is a remarkable and mysterious magical item. I kind of wish Lindsay had stayed a bard. No, I don't. Because I don't know if glibness is in this game or not. Oh, I don't know. Hmm. What are the odds of me getting that? I need a, a 15. Yeah. The nearly wish so she needs you. I'll handle it from here. God. Uh, you think I work for that skin bag? I'd sooner cut off my horns, but you apparently lack my exquisite judge of character. Worms, attack them. Oh, no, that's rude. Are you a bard? <laughs> Stop that. Cessator. Put your didgeridoo away. Are you? Uh, you? You gotta go do a thing. Yep. Okay. You need to do it quietly. I don't want to mute. You can't get out. You need to do this before the stream or hold it. And that was loud. Okay, so now it's just me and I'm gonna talk because that door's gonna be super loud. And it's gonna open in the middle of the stream. And we're gonna kill worms. Kill the doggos. And here we go. And there's a ground worm. Oh, now he's dead. That was ridiculously easy. Not. I'll take your stuff. Well, what is your stuff? A plus one short bow. That's what I always wanted. Also, now my cat's in here. Hooray! Plus two chain shirt. Man, this guy had so much good gear. I think it's the crown that I'm all worried about, though. Nice. Serves you right. And moving on about our day, we'll go this way. He's somewhere. There's gonna be a cat jump up here in like two seconds. He's gonna be all over the place because that's what it is. Azazel does! Don't like surprises. There he is. He's here in the room. I want to see what's there. Oh, oh my. I can't even. I can see it, but I can't attack it. I'll just run away. You can't catch me? Oh, oh my. You can catch me. Oh lordy. Oh lordy. The whole crown's got worms. This is just kind of annoying. I guess I can probably only see them because it. No. No, the Gongar's Dragon said the levels don't break the line effect. Or, yeah, his line effect is still broken. He can't see any of them. Rather. Hi, Azazel. All this you gonna come stream with me? You gonna come help me find the crown? Yeah, we're just gonna fight a bunch of Hydras, I guess. A blood for Gorum! No loss. No loss. It's not bad. That's not nice. We can't pass that fort save with flying colors. Evening! Just will be 1958. And there's Zazel. Hi, buddy. Hi, buddy. Ooh, Lindsay level. Well done, Lindsay. Little Lindsay. Taking your sorcerer level. You're a Sylvan sorcerer. Oh, I don't know why I had to stop and think about that. And triggery up. Knowledge world up. Mm -mm up. All right, Azazel. Buddy. Hey, what spell should I take? He doesn't know. He'll give me a boop anyway. Boop, boop, boop. Well, what do I do? What's a good one? Circle of Death. Disintegrates a spell. Hmm. Dragon kind one could make more dragons. Always is nice. I bite. F 
phantasmal putrefaction. Hmm. Hmm. True seeing. Because I think that comes up at some point. I think I remember hearing that that will be an important spell for me. So we'll take that. More importantly, our Mastodon gets a little stronger because she's a Sylvan Sorcerer, and that's kind of the point, is just have as many pets as possible. Actually, I could have done that a lot differently, but I'll love Perhaps another time. Do 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 do. Oh, oh, yeah, I forgot about this. <laughs> you there, help me with this thing. <laughs> just ahead, a man in the dark robes of Ferezman Priest battles an enormous spiked beast. While he's holding his own with magic and a sword with a melted-looking hilt, the snarling beast has him cornered. Suddenly he catches sight of you. You there! Help me with this thing! Attack Lenorm. I hope he helps. I'm not buffed! Here we go. No buffs. This is the no buffs run. Is there a time limit on this game? There's... Kind of. Days pass, things happen, but I'm at a point in the game where the time limit kind of isn't happening anymore. You suck. Two moons is great. The, the fire hurts. Well, sir. The robed man nods gratefully at you. Thank you for the help. If Shaika hadn't sent you, I'd, I'd... I feel like Selim has that kind of voice. I'd have been in real trouble. He frowns. Of course, if Shaika hadn't sent me after this stupid shard, I wouldn't have been fighting this overgrown lizard in the first place. You're still in real trouble! What are you? I'm just... the an inquisitor. Okay, that is a bad. Oops! Well, now that we've solved that, we'll take his piece of the crown. We'll take his piece of the crown. Oh, that's that's great. That's just so great. <laughs> good. Good. Oh, okay, it's right there. That's good. Fortunately, it's not on that man's. Also, I find it weird that Lenorm scales only set me back 600 gold. Or rather, only net me 600 gold. And that's two pieces of the crab. I, won't be I see someone has decided to join us. Oh, there was ghosts! I forgot there were ghosts! <sighs> Apparently it doesn't matter that there were ghosts. Yeah, we're fine. We're so fine. The finest. Finest ever! No one can defeat us. <laughs> well, we're a little, a little spooked. spooky ghosts. Oh, harem. Yikes. He'd be alright. He didn't need all of his stuff. Hi. Hi, Azazel. We're trying to do stuff right now. You want me to get taken? Only if he gets in the way. Okay. Just use your breath weapon! Oh, he's down. He's, he's super hexed. Oh, my. We'll be fine. This is, this is all acceptable casualties in the wall. Hello, buddy. Am I still afraid? I have a big frighten. Big, big frighten. And then Amiri gets the frighten as well. Oh my, that's just so many. Yeah, I think it's time to get the kitty out of here. Okay, yep, yeah, that's fair. Well, that's all unfortunate. They have a lot of ghost rogues. That's a lot of ghost rogues. That's an inordinate amount of ghost rogues. But I just keep getting banished from... Come on. Come on. Stop being a Fred. You are not a Fred. You are... Yes! Yes, Amiri! This is the... the yes! And... Well, you can't really do anything else. You're out of rage. Oom. Come on, two minutes. Come on, buddy. You only got... Three, two, one, blast off. Hi. Sorry. Yep. Okay, you're gonna rage. You're gonna do a heal real quick. And then you're gonna slap the ghosts. It's the new name of the game. Come on. At least try. There we go. Is Miri oh, down? Right. Me and Miri's super down. Oh, I don't know when I saved last. That's unfortunate. <laughs> I wonder if I can just run away from him. Probably not, right? Oh, I'm out of here! 
Goodbye! Hello purple worms, there are a lot of purple worms. I'm faster than the ghosts are! I'm gonna go over here. Unworthy to catch me! Because we're all really dead. I guess stop raging. <laughs> Even though that'll slow me down a little. And now combat has ended. Now they lay them down to sleep. The ball. Now that combat's over, let's all take a time to be reminded that we have potions. <laughs> and we're not in combat right now. Remember, it's not cheating. It's using your resources. Hard. Real hard. The hardest use of resources. Oh, come on, Amiri. The A-Train needs more fuel. A-Train needs the most fuel. She does have the widest gulf to cross there. Oh! 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 Damn it. Oh! 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 She oh. keeps rolling so low. Not that oh. much of it. What'd you say? Sometimes she keeps rolling so low, and it's like, come on. She's fine. She'd be good. Regongar is the one I should be worried about. Because we need to stop and buff. Because <laughs> I didn't have to buff through the Lenorm fight. I didn't have to buff through all the purple worms. I do need to buff for the ghosts. Okay, good enough. Well, everyone else should heal. Am I going to run out of all these potions? I don't have enough Cure Light Wounds to get through this. But we're going to try. How many Cure Light Wounds does it take to get to the center of your Dwarven Granddad? We're gonna cheat a little. I think it was like 20. Who else exists? Jadel's kind of on her own. Two moons. Oh lord. Oh. 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 Wow. Oh. Oh. Remind me when we're in town, I need to buy more potions. <laughs> oh. I need to go to town after this too, as everyone is upset. Is there a drink all the potions? Can I do that? Does that exist? Is that viable in this meta? Good enough. Jaithel's on her own, because she has to be, because she's not people anymore. And now everyone but two moons go over here. You guys too. We're gonna... Damn, never mind. Oh, I didn't have time to buff. That's unfortunate. Your life ebbs low. That's alright. We're all good. Hey, have you heard about my dragon friends? I got two of them. Kyle right who I've heard. Paradot Wyvern. And now with my two dragon friends, I will try again and probably still die a miserable death all alone. But oh, where are they? Oh, okay, I see. There they are. Give them the zats! Give them a heckin' big zats! Or just do that. It is also pretty good. Why are Because it's chasing the Mastodons? Oh my- Oh! Oh my! That's so much worse! Hello! Hello, spoopy monster that makes several copies of itself! Oh! Oh, those aren't true mirror images either. Those can attack. That's why I love that thing so much. That's why I was freaking out about it in, uh, in, uh, uh Barnhol's Lot. Uh-huh! Yeah, it's just really, really powerful. Oh, Lindsay's gone. I'll have to go back home and get Lindsay. See how they're all attacking? It functions like a mirror image, but even scarier. Huh? If you can't tell which one to hit. There is a Slayer archetype that does that. It's really cool. It's very cool. Hold on, everyone! Here comes Santa Claus! 
never mind. No, no. Oh, stop! <laughs> Too many! Oh, what a something. Yeah. Oh, all right. They're basically lined up. Chaffle's at negative 69. Oh, Chaffle. Oh, nice. I forgot to hit, like, you hit them once and they go away. But that doesn't mean there's not five really high armor class guys. Those are so good. And now that that's over. Become as dust. You tell him, Harem. Yeah, let's save. That was a harrowing encounter. Do 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 do. Where are my wyverns? Do do. There they are. Yes. Oh, is it flying? It is. Oh, he's flying. Oh, they're flying. Look at him go. Look at him floop his little wings. Yes. Yes. Good. That makes me so happy. Oh, Mastodon died for some reason. Stop dying, Mastodon. No one told you to die. It's got a thing on it. Oh, it's doing a floop. Who cares? Wyverns are better. They floop. They do a heckin' floop. Floop. Mablati! For a moment. Lost. How do we... Wait. Mastodon. Mastodon is confused! Oh, Mastodon, stop that. Is so Harem's so down. Harem can- okay, Harem can help, help the doggo. A poor doggo. Needs a friend. That friend is a scroll. I'm sorry, kind of brain farted. Uh, scroll of... There we go. Every Permanently confused go. dog. A Try magic. Yeah. I like how I can't see the DC of that mobility check. I guess we're gonna just keep trying. That's what we got. Oh, hold on. If it wants Amiri to do it, Amiri can at least remove her armor. It's a minus two. It's really not that bad, yeah. It's still something. Weak suffering. I endure. Okay. How hard is that check? It doesn't even show you trying to make the check. That does my concern. I'm beginning to think that you don't actually exist. It has to, though. It does. You're right. That's, That's really weird. confusing. Because there's nothing else over here to which I am... I'm listening. You're also not wearing your armor. My dude. There we go. Okay, that's not the right armor. That's the black dragon armor. You wear the battle master's plate. Are you wearing the battle master? Mmm, there it is. Much better. Shiny golden armor. As befits shiny golden Amiri. Pay attention! Elvin Dion. Stop it! Oh, never mind. Those are just swarms of spiders everywhere. Oh, Drop a fireball in their butts for Gongar. That will kill the party. We have to have a little more attack. Assist me or lose me. Wretched things. Oh my, it's Paladin's Booters. Oh, gross. Okay. I need everyone to just take off. No, I don't need you to do that. Need you just, everyone goes that way. I don't really care if I hit the wyverns. That's just that is what it is. Mm -hmm. I still didn't kill it. God. Hmm. No, it's Jaythel. It's gotta be how it is. What are you doing? It's not Lining nice. up to it to call lightning. Death comes. Did this spell fail? 
The spell didn't fail. I successfully resolved the casting. So we're... Confusion. Despicable. Yeah, it is. So I don't know where that spell is, my guy. I guess... I'm trying to see if anybody else has any, like, crappy little blast that Radongar can survive with his seven hit points. Do we have alchemist fires? Yeah. Because I think that's all I need, is just a, a little push. Good enough for me. Okay. Oh, I was taking con damage from uh, from a dead wyvern. Sorry, buddy. I think all I did was kill you. I'm not as rude as I think I am. In this chest is what? Uh, good job. Very nice. Very nice. Magic Bardish. Champion of Graves. Oh, that's kind of cool. Ooh. Plus five with a bunch of random negative energy damage. Sure, I'll take it. So I have to make that mobility check, don't I? Here's a save. But I don't know the DC, and I'm just kind of throwing stuff at the board in vain. But it's the only way to get over there. Unless I can go this way. It looks like I might be able to cross through right here. Battles await. Apparently not. No. Together we are unstoppable. We are indeed, Ragongar. Not quite. We're pretty beat up, actually. Damn. That's unfortunate. I was hoping I could just dim door over it. I'm gonna burn a lot of spell slots and then rest. Can I just... Oh. Oh, oh Harem died. I died. Free. Well. Yeah. That's rude. That is so That rude. is the rudest ever. God, what is that mobility check? Jesus. I don't know. Maybe it's a destined to fail thing. Maybe. I don't know. That's really weird. Maybe that's why it doesn't show DC. Just rude. Yeah. There's no indication of, like, this is how you get around it. Fortunately, I just saved. Maybe I need to go grab Lindsay. Yeah. Yeah. She is very helpful. Let me just wait for her to get back. And then I could go retrain two moves. Kill two tire bears with one stone here. Hey, this is from before the spider fight? Question mark. No, he just is back alive for some reason. Nice! Look at all my dragon friends. Fly! Do a heckin' fly! It was so cool. Do it again. Come on. Come on. Come on, fly. Maybe you have to go further off away. Go over there. See what that is. Why is JFL making a knowledge arcana? We'll never know, I guess. Mm, I'm gonna go explore this part of the map. Yeah, that's fair. That feels like a trap. Or that I need a magic item or something. Right, because it's not giving me a DC and it's just hurting. Yep. So there should be something else there. Wait. Yes, that is so awesome. Where to note. now? Is that what the spell is for? No. We're gone, Gar! Come on! That hurts my feelings. So bad. I think we all understand why I did that. Yep. I thought he too would do a heckin' fly alongside these mighty wyverns. Noblest of beasts! Heckin' fly and above! But not Ragongar, he's just slower than everyone else for some reason now. No burrow speed, no fly speed, just... It is kind of funny to just watch a giant blue dragon, like, bound like that. He can show you the world. <laughs> Oh, 
Oh, oh my. It's a giant. It's a dire baby! Fireball. No, I can't right now. I'll do this instead. That's fine. If you're not Rigongar, let's go this way. Or not! Okay. Fear his wrath, or it may be great. Tiny babies. I killed somebody I wasn't supposed to. Oh my god, they're covered in tiny little babies! They are covered in little babies! What is this world? What is. Come, life! Get mad! Punch that giant dire baby! It has wronged us. For the last time, the dire baby! I mean, not all at once. Jeez. Can Ragongar cast like this? I mean, no, but. Well, he has, he has skew mats, because he's, no, he doesn't. He's not a sorcerer. He can't cast. Thank you. But that couldn't happen. Confusion. Dragons do it all the time. He doesn't have access to a spell this way. Whatever. I guess I'm not going to look at a gift wiper in the mouth. Oh, yeah. Having sneak attack is so much better for dragon disciples than any way I've ever built them. Look at all those natural attacks. There's so many, so many. So many D6s. Because, yeah, that's like what? Four claws, two wings, and a tail? You don't ever attack with the back claws? Do you have the thing? No, we'll take it. It's a probably claw, claw, bite, wing, wing, tail for six. I assume. Onwards. To the land of Quixave! An all dragon disciple party would be fun. The Council of Worms! Wait, do, you want, do you want to be my friend? Yes, friends. Tree friends. Friendly trees. The forest here looks blasted apart by a meteorite, complete with fallen trees and a crater at its center. Surrounding the crater are several huge twisted trees. Suddenly the trees turn to look at you. A jagged maw opens in one of the trunks. With a voice like creaking wood, the tree ant says, who disturbs the prayers to our fallen friends? More of the wriggling man's something. Obscene minions. Ah, I'm nobody's minion. Then you are not our concern. Leave this place and let us mourn our dead. Time to chop some wood! Then you must be pruned. Your bones will fertilize the forest. The druids in the party probably have a problem. Whoa! He's an anger boy. Anger man. And we are so beat up. They're about to be more beat up than we are. This can't be over. Oh, there are so many more. Oh, I didn't think there'd be this many when I started to pick a fight. Oh, 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 uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Two wounds is down. Uh oh. A train, A train, chugga chugga woo woo. Gongar is dead. Oh my. Miri, like you, had to go to the bathroom. What time is it? It is 9.14. Yeah, a little less than an hour. Mm -hmm. So we're still going to work out tonight even though we go to the store? Mm -hmm. Do you want to go to the store first? Sure. Kind of shake it up a little. Yeah. And do it on the way back. But I need your word you're going to work out. Okay. I have to be responsible for both of this. Because I'm not responsible on my own, I guess. Let's go! Take a nap! This place is rude and full of mean people. Oh, oh, oh. Man, why? That's so unfortunate. I don't know how to make everybody else fly. I guess I just literally have to, like, go into overland travel mode. Mm -hmm. So then if you never got any of these wyverns, you'd never see that. Why can't Ragongar fly? That's really cool, though. Even if it's just, like, a crappy little animation. I really appreciate that. It's really cool. I'm gonna go get another Mastodon. The amount of Mastodons in this party is too low. Partially because Lindsay's gone, partially because one of them's dead. But I am gonna go ahead and commit to retraining Tomb Raiders because I complained about it a lot in the early episodes of this. That I just really wanted him to be a, a mad dog. Yes. Good. So many pets. So many pets. <laughs> More this... pets than you can shake up your pets at. <laughs> Pick up your cats and shake them, and they will turn into big elephants. Yo, dog, I heard you like pets. 
I heard you like the action economy. Alright. Home. So far away. So far away. Oh, jeez. Oh, well, I guess, couldn't I just... If I didn't want to retrain, I could just yeah, grab Lindsay grab back. <laughs> That's so cheap. Also, can I just say... Making Lindsay walk by herself for two days? Yeah, that. But also, like, her random plot armor that she has no reason to have. Other than, like, we're letting her do the riding. Right? Why else does she have that? Yeah, that's fair. We're going back to the Luli Lulu's lair. Of graveyard of bones. Because <laughs> I killed it. Killed it dead. And for what? XP? Yeah, XP. That's why we did that it. sweet, sweet XP. I haven't had a good dragon fight in a while. I guess that's not true. And there was a dragon fight in Rune Lords that I got the pin out of the sky, which was kind of fun. That's pretty cool. Oh, peaceful travelers! There's peaceful travelers! It's probably Skelly Boy and his oh. horse once again. Mm -hmm. Okay, here we go. Did you? Oh, we got. Well, that's what. Not good. What did the chat thing say? Regongar dies. But like, there was something before that. Hang I on. Thought. It's not important right now. What's important is my buddy's dead. I still have an obscene statue of- Is it the same one as the potions? No, it's not. It's much farther down. Oh, I used that on myself. Stop that! Bulls are expensive! Can I please? Share your will. Does resurrection take you to full health? Oh, yeah, it does. You could just cast resurrection and it's a full heal. Cause now we're is a full health for no mm. reason. Get up, nerd! Hello, skilly boy. Have you got anything new? Probably not, right? Perhaps not. No, some of these are new, I feel like. Didn't you sell them those? I might have. I don't remember. That's sweet. No, these are- some of these are definitely new. Changer of life. Of life! Changer of life! Yeah, move to her. <laughs> the wand of resounding blow. Just take my stuff, please. I'm gonna hold on to that spear. I feel like that spear is gonna be real nice at some point. I don't think we're done with it yet. Oh, I forgot I have that. Keen adamantine halberd. I don't need that. Not really. Yeah. It's just not that useful. Sorry. For us in particular. Sorry, Castruccio, you're a vieti. Should have had better gear, you heckin' nerdy boy. With your funny name. I think that you're is like the farthest thing from a nerdy boy. So what is he then? Jockey boy. Nah. Or like a bro. I mean... Plus seven's pretty pretty. Doesn't Lindsay use bracers of armor? Nope. Yep. You're right. <laughs> oh. I wouldn't call him Jockey, bro. He's not in shape enough. And he's he, he talks too nicely. That's why that's why he's like a bro. He's more like a like some like rich lawyer's kid who's gone to school and inherited everything but has no business to have done so. Nappy time. I wonder. Is it the constant cold that makes northern barbarian brains work so slowly? Or is it that the tribes are so secluded that they've become incestuous? I wonder too. Our old ones start drooling around 90. But you elves live for hundreds of years. How much idiocy do you save up in your heads over the ages? So, I'm gonna point out that as a fault. Dinner's ready. As a follower of Urgothoa, Jaithalon might not have a problem with incest, because it's all about serving your hunger, your pleasures. 
So I don't know what they're trying to imply there. Are we gonna get Lindsay or we're gonna go home and get Lindsay? We're gonna go home and get Lindsay. Oh, okay. We've been over this. That's why we're walking home. I just, I just didn't know if you friend. changed your mind. I want my Macedon! You want to stop me talking about incest. I was not trying to do that, but I do want you to stop talking about incest. Why? It's an important thing. Sorry we haven't talked about that yet. <laughs> Load times are long. Load times are long. I'm kind of hungry. Load times are long. That's all these streams have ever been when we stream on Thursday nights. Just, I'm a little hungry. You ready to eat? Let's go eat. I'm hungry. Evade! Continue away! I really feel like with all the high strength and Mastodon characters, we might not have like woodland stride, but I think there comes a point where the trees are no longer a problem. Accurate. I forget what the lift overhead for 36 after rage strength is, but like, it's not a little. To Tusk Day! To the Tavern. So this is going to take a minute, but you're going to see a thing. Oh, last time I did this, it crashed the game. We should stay first. We should stay first. You're very right. You're so right. But, since my early days of getting too many Mastodons, I've complained about not enough Mastodons. It's a real problem. It's a huge problem, but not enough Mastodons meta. Exactly. Two Moons' time as a Barbarian has been great. This time of a really slow load is not great. There we go. Gotta talk to Noriel, the Spooder, Spooder girl. Hey, Spooder girl! I would like to use the tutor services. It's free! For me! I have me selected, right? I'm not sure how to tell. Okay, I do. I am instead Asha. Check it. Oh, I gotta do all my stats over. That's fine. That's yeah. not a big deal. Am I really an elf? Yeah, that hasn't changed. It's gotta be that face. No, it's gonna be that face. <laughs> not that one. That one's a little too. The bangs are too kind. And that's why I did this hairstyle. And hair color is as silvery as we can get it. That's kind of blue. Quick. Yeah, that'd be fine. It's a little different, but it'd be cool. My first levels are going to be the two-handed fighter, as before. So I can get access to Vital Strike for lots of damage. And then I'm going to take Barbarian levels, but this time I'm going to be a Mad Dog. I forget exactly what it does. I, I don't Rage until 4th. So I will have a little... I'll take extra Rage once. But I'll have a pet. Yay! And you know what that pet will be. Big old fuzzy boy. Big old fuzzy... It'll be me. <laughs> Big old fuzzy boy. <laughs> but first, fire levels. Feet hair. Two-handed feet hair. Hoopa. I'm gonna build a little differently than I did last time. I'm not super comfortable dumping my wisdom. Hmm. There's just a lot of little things. One point left. Yik. Can't. Math. We'll do this. Damn. I still have that one odd point, don't I? I hate that so much. Because I don't want to waste it. Wait. 
Oh, deliberations! Wait, didn't it just work? Oh, yeah, but I don't have an odd con. I guess it can be fine. I'll just go one, two. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, I'll be right. And what do we do? Perception. That's it, basically. <laughs> and my feet will be... Combat reflexes. Followed by... Exotic weapon proficiency, choosing the shard. Because now I don't have to wait a million years to have a new one. Yeah. Feels good. My name is a poopy butt. Probably still angry. I lead. You follow. Well, I passed it. Six of rest. Tommy's breath. None shall escape! Hmm. What an anger, boy. We're gonna go back. I'm sorry, everyone. I need to take the barbarian level first. Because I want to be in the barbarian gear. Well, no, I... No, I don't. Doesn't matter. I'm gonna be wearing armor. It's entirely arbitrary. Well, oh, gotta do all that again, don't I? Not much. Yeah, I just gotta put the fighter stuff back on. I am superior! Yeah. Tell him two moons. Yeah, my dude. So, a couple more levels of fighter. So, when we're vital striking, we're doing double strength damage, which is really gnarly. But let me tell you what. So, the power attack is next. Don't let me miss any important feats. Plus, one more level of fighter, which gets us overhand chop, which is really nice when you're vital striking. Chop, chop. It's very good. What does overhand chop do? When you do a single action, or a single attack in a round, such as vital strike to charge or the attack action, you do double strength damage. Oh. With a two-handed weapon, yeah, it's really good. Chop, chop. Chop, chop, indeed. Now, what are my feats from here forward? Well, I ended up with uh, improved critical at one point. But it's going to be a while before I can get that. Mm -hmm. So now I'm... Uh, I was furious focused in this game, I forget. Yes, because I think Jaythal has it. Yeah. Maybe not. Maybe. I guess I don't qualify yet. Mm. I will take outflank. Mm. I guess I won't take it yet. Never mind. Precise strike. Because everyone's got it. And that's over in shop. And here forward will be barbarian levels, but this time it's Mad Dog. Did they add any new? They didn't. And there's no Snick. There's no Snick. I could take Animal Companion and continue. No Snick. Does it literally just like give you like the rest of the? No, because it's A through W right now. Y'all know what it is. Master Dog. Mass Toden. And we'll run those the rest of the way up. I'll have a little less rage. What's pack tactics? I don't know what this archetype does. Plus four attack rolls while flanking. What else do I get? Improved trip on uh, the Mastodon, so that's a thing. That is pretty nice. Can eventually DR danger signs. I thought there might have been possibly the possibility that I'd be able to pass on my rage to my animal companion. Because mm -hmm. there are ways to do that in Pathfinder. I just don't know what rage powers exist. Boon companion. Do I need to take boon companion? I mean, you're going to take extra rage, right? Hang on. Hold on. Whoa, whoa, whoa. A wa 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 I mean, it's acting like I need it. It wouldn't show that feat if... We gotta slow it down even more. Hey, God. I don't know what my effective druid level is. I'm not sure if this advances at the same rate. Nothing advances at the same rate as druid level. That's not true. What does? I don't know. 
I don't know what this archetype does or not. I need you to Google it. Okay. Yeah, so say most things are... Like... Some things advance as... Uh, like a full sum advance like rangers and it's offering me boon companion which means i probably don't but i'm not super sure so after you get a look at that i need to see it in kingmaker one too oh sorry hold on hold on Using the Barbarian's level as effective Druid level. Oh, wait, never mind. I'm sorry, you didn't need to look that up. It does use it as effective Druid level. I have three fighter levels. Duh. <laughs> sorry right. about it. Sorry about it. I'm really sorry. <laughs> uh, I'm not dumb. You can't prove otherwise. We're both. What feat did I take? Oh, Boon Companion, duh. I'm so good at this. We're a little wore out here. I'm like actually not. I'm not at all. Not wore out, just wasn't thinking about it because I'm kind of doing this quickly. That's fair. You might be wore out. I'm very wore out. Not me. I'm actually doing pretty good today. That's just surprising. Good. That's awesome. Good to. I don't think that was a safe. It's just like. I was like, what? what? I was on a save. I'm serious. I'm going to take extra rage because I don't get rage till here. Which means I have less rounds of rage here. Oh, now I don't remember if I probably don't, so I'm just gonna take Swift Foot a bunch. I know I took that at least once. We are Barian. And buff the con out. What? Why? No. We have one rank of knowledge roll. Hurry for me. I know things about the world knowledge -ly. Is there any one level dips I need? Probably not. Not that I can think of. Not for a strength based barbarian? Yeah, no. For a second I was like, rogue? Question mark? But, nah. Seems bad. Okay. So I should now be at the point where vital strike improved critical. So now I gotta start paying a little more attention here. Improved critical with shard. Woo! And then all my feats from here out, basically, are the Vital Strike feats. Wow. Hello. Mm -hmm. There it is. Vital Strike. More DR! Because DR 1 or 2 is bad, but if I can buff it out enough. Do you think all my gear is gonna fall off? I don't know, actually. Oh, worried. I'll find it all again. Yeah, no, it's just a huge pain. Yeah, it's true. And then improve vital strike. I got a pet doggo. Okay. Greater rage, vital strike. Ray. And bigger Babrion. That's that's the actual term for my class, thank you. <laughs> thank you very much! Uh, Alright, here we go. Next. Hope you guys are enjoying watching me do math really quickly. Well, there's no math because it's done for me. Which is great. It is. Where's Greater Vital Strike? I don't quite qualify. So then the next level will still need to be a fighter level, no matter how you cut it. Which isn't the worst thing. I still have one more level worth of, like, Boon Companion. Mm hmm. Yeah, so be it. So then here it's Utflank. Because everybody has it. V good? Yes. Should have taken that before. Okay. 
So I have 15 levels right now and I'm going to 16. Yeah, this does seem like a good place to take this feat. Both because it's the end of the game and because I feel like um, 5, 10, and 15 are usually the levels where there's kind of like a, a dip down. That way you don't feel as bad about multi-classing. I don't feel bad about multi-classing at all. I have enough rage to get through probably. And now I have a, another full hit dice animal companion. Mm -hmm. I have a little less hit points. But here's my new buddy. Does he seem bigger? Mm-mm. Oh, fair enough. And all my gear fell off. There's Naked, Naked Man. Moons. Hello, Naked Two Moons. Hope you're uh, doing good there, buddy. There's your big serpent prince. Here's your shining armor. This. At least it's pretty easy to tell who had what. Mm hmm. So that's a thing that's neat. Fire! Oh, here are my rings. I thought I had a plus five. And I had a ring of luck. I didn't have the amulet of the four elements. Oh, you know who does have that? Hmm. Is that better? No, it's not. The plus one damage per die rolled is really nice. But I don't want to put it on Ragongar at the cost of that. Hmm. Yeah, he'll be fine. Just fine. Now I gotta grab Tiger, all of my pets. Come on, guys. We have so many heckin' pets. We do. It's yes. kind of the point of the build. Great. It's pretty dope. And now we got four mastodons! Woo! Oh yeah! And two moons now has a, a mastodon that I can't see through. And RBF. I want to save. I'm going to... Do areas respawn with monsters again? I don't think so. I think stuff can happen in them. Like, as chapters go, but I don't think they, like, re-up. I just want to see what happens. I can reload. She can't take any archetypes. Oh, really? Let me make sure she's not a level 1 barbarian. Okay, we're good. Otherwise, she'd be bad. a mad dog too. And then I'd have 5 mastodons. So many mastodons. That feels really good. I'm really happy about that. Maybe it's a little much. It'll be fun. But I think it's really cool. Mm -hmm. That's, I was going to call this episode So Much Death, but now it's going to be called The Fourth Mastodon. And everyone will know I've made a new friend. The greatest friend. They awaken. That would be dope. They'd be smarter than us. <laughs> Come on, buddy. Let's go. Is he really an elf? He ain't no elf. I'm an elf. I found some stuff. To no <laughs> end. God. Thanks for your money, I guess. Hurrah. Huzzah. And how do I go to full? Because I have a different person now, I guess. Nice. Well, already. Feels good. If only the Titan Muller was in here. That's my only real, like, come on, man. Because Two Moons, originally, the OG Two Moons in Pennebaber was a Titan Muller, two-handed fighter, Gestalt. I also think Amira makes a ton of sense as a Titan Mauler. It's like, you're gonna put her in the game. If you're gonna give her an oversized weapon, which is what the Titan Mauler does. Yeah, give her an excuse to be able to use that thing. I guess it'd be a little difficult to track oversized weapons on everybody, but also, no, it wouldn't. You know what I mean? Woo! Thanks for our community. Oh, my. Two weeks. Two bald hilltop. I can't go there now. If these horrors. I think I think my dude is still Ah! Didn't mean to do that! No! I hate that. Fi on them! Fee! Oh man, that changes all my buff patterns now. What yes. this? There's a fourth mass. Look at my mass joints. Look at me, how many buddies I got. Where's the where's the fourth one? Who has the fourth one? It's two moons, harem, J Lindsay, Jathel. So it's at the the only place Jathel is in is in her room in the tavern. Mm. I got so many heckin' doggos. So many. <laughs> anyway, how long before Lindsay's done with what she's doing? Oh, two days. So I'm gonna I'm gonna do that, just to say we did it. I guess I have no other real reason to do it. Nice. Okay, cool. 
So then I would like Jathal to take over as, or it could be the storyteller. I want to be Jathal, who seeks to control and dominate the fine arts. She's a, I can't think of the name of the movie, but it's a, uh, it's a Mozart movie, and it's told from the point of view of his rival, Salieri. Do you know what I'm talking about? You no, but all? that's really cool. I Play like that. Salieri. I can't believe you've never seen that. I think it's I think it's literally called Rock Me on the Days. No, no, it isn't. I forget. It's a good movie though. Alrighty. That's enough of that nonsense. Lindsay! Grand diplomat! Hurrah! Still don't have- And Lindsay was called for it. Oh, <gasps> Whale hunt! The Alphan Seafarers are gonna go hunt some whales. Yeah, go kill some whales, Lindsay. You got this. That's horrible. It's delicious. What do you think I'm go carrying? Go climpy tax, you nerd. What do you think I'm doing? Oh, you did. Oh. What do you think I'm doing with all these mastodons? How come we don't have the, the thing on the map then? Oh. Oh, I just... Uh, okay, my bad. <laughs> I have never been there. My other city. It's probably fine how it is. Yeah. Um... It's pretty good buffs. I'm gonna go there. I wanna see what I can upgrade. That's fair. I'm gonna burn it all down and replace it with stocks. Festival! Yeah, it's fine, whatever. Mansione! Inferi's palace, can't do anything about that. Cathedral. I really wanna get rid of that, but it's whatever. No villa. Can I not upgrade anything? There we go. Man, he's got so much better stuff. Someone took their kingdom building very seriously. And he still died, so who cares? <laughs> Come on. Jeez. But he can build a lot more stuff, too. Nice. I think I'd like this place better if it had at least one goblin quarters. Right next to where your bed used to live. <laughs> now it's more like home. Ooh, military cavalry. That's dope. Give me one of those. Give me back that filet of fish. Free Sword Lord Academy. That's pretty cool, actually. But I can't oh, put it anywhere because it takes four. Oh, sad. Can I put the Barbas? No. Vault of Forbidden Knowledge. Just got a bunch of ones now. What would you already Iroveti? Words are hard. Let's just do a bunch of black markets. I can only have the one. Poop! Jail for your betting body. Yeah, I'm gonna put a mage. I can't. Damn. Damn. But there's so much open space. Dumb. It is heckin' rude. The heckin' rudest. Whatever. I'll put some shops down. Make a miss some money. Can I rename that? Beatbox. I can rename. Wait. Stop everything. Go back. We have to go back. We have to go. Hello, Mastodon. Have to go back to Pitex. No! Two. Cannon! Pitex! In the wiki! Ha ha! Ho oh, ho! Good! Did I save it though? I gotta be sure. Yes! <laughs> yes! That's what they get. That's exactly what they get. We will fondly remember the P-Tex. Extraordinary goods. I have no foons. Espionage would be nice. Yeah, I forget what they get to. Um, I'm just gonna spin the clock, I think. No, I'm not. No, I'm not. So yeah, we gotta get to the, uh, the ball to the top. No, we don't. We have to go back to... Uh, where those trains were. Oh. Because we still have like less than two weeks. Right. So I can swing back. But now I got a fourth mast on. I'm so happy. I'm so happy. Oh! My oh. queen! This will only take a moment. Really. It's nothing. But I do need your advice. You do a really good Lindsay voice. Oh, thanks. 
Some hunters from P-Tax are yes, wondering... Yes, that's how it's pronounced now. <laughs> ...are wandering the outskirts of your kingdom. If you ask me, I don't care. That's enough game for everyone. But the locals are outraged. What kind of kingdom is it if just anyone can cross our borders? That they are part of our borders now. Lindsay shrugs. We are not going to introduce border patrols because a couple of does get shot, right? Right? They're literally... I mean, this is the one I would do. Lindsay Lewis had a disappointing moment. Seriously? Just because someone got lost while they were hunting? We could pretend we didn't notice, Almost, Lindsay. It's an excuse for violence, come on. Well, also it increased our community, which was bad, so... Bakken! Pop it! Stop it! Stop it! Stop it! Stop it! Thank you for the sunshine in a bag. There you go, you still need Bakken. I need you to give me something specific. I need more potions. Well, I'm here. This is a book of ours I wanted to read of transmutations and bodily poisons in three volumes. If you would find it for me, I, God, I've sold those, I think. Not even. Oh, there's no use empty words. Okay. I know the old bell dame, the old witch of the swamp, just one of the volumes in her hut gathering dusk. She must sell it for sale, I imagine. I need to find an idea. You might look at a magic shop or in the bookcases and locked drawers of other alchemists. If you happen to across the possessions of adventures. Oh, my. Who who even knows where those are at this point? Dang it, Bakken. Yeah, we got to him really late. <laughs> oh well. It is what it is. Hold up. Really quickly. I really want to put some of these bracers of armor. Oh, sure, yes, plus eight. God damn it. Oh well. Really want to put some of those on my mastodons. Because I can. Anyway, one second. It's certainly a book I only have one of. I've seen them, but I don't know where they are now. Whatever. I was like to the lead, not to read. <laughs> Come, Mastodon! Yes, we must go! You will walk through the fire, and you will fear no fire, because you are my buddy. Yes, push, push! Push! Get in here, Lindsay. Woohoo, Lindsay! Mastodon's four days. Four days, indeed. <laughs> God, if I could... I won't use the mod to remake Amiri as a mad dog, but it's so tempting. Because mm -hmm. then it'd be everyone but Ragongar, and it'd be weird for Ragongar to have an animal companion. It would be. I don't think there's any way I could do it, and it wouldn't just have like two hit dice, or like four. Yeah. Yeah. Well, he's a dragon. I'll give the dragons to Ragongar, and those are Ragongar's animal companions now, I guess. Alright. Amiri, why do you have string damage on you? Probably those ghosts. Oh, that's fair. Well, let's run to the castle of Kniffs. Ooh. Oh, to the castle of Kniffs! Wow! This is not the fastest way. It might be. I guess you get out of the forest. Yeah, sure, fine, whatever. I wonder what my carrying capacity looks like now. Obscene. Some. <laughs> Some. It's a number, I'll say that. Resting would be nice, don't you think? There's gonna be nothing to fight, but I just, I really want to see all my boys in their glory. <gasps> ah! Glorious. I do it. I really want to tell everyone, wait. One of these Mastodons isn't auto-charging because he's new. There we go. So many Mastodons all over the battlefield! This is neat. Blessed be the dogs! Oh, no, wait, we're fighting words. Blessed be the true dogs! The true dogs! These are fake dogs! Drain the dogs! They're the drakes of dogs. I mean, drakes aren't super bad in Pathfinder. They're not, but they're not true dragons. They get- they are, though. Pathfinder drakes are true dragons? Mm hmm in 3-5, like, the only thing's that... Were they, like, magical beasts or something in 3-5? Uh, I believe so, yeah. Big suited. I'm trying to remember what all are true dragons. I think it might just be, like, dragons and kobolds and, like, the dragon turtle thingy. Mm, yeah. Kobolds aren't dragons in Pathfinder. Mm -hmm. They're monstrous humanoids, but, like, the tazzle worms, drakes, uh, wyverns. 
Wow. All our D12 hit dice and have the immunities. Yeah, I think it was. I think it was races. I think it was races of the dragon in three five that gave you rules for kobolds as true dragons, which Monster. gets pretty funny when nice. you start making, you know, ancient great worm kobolds. <laughs> I guess it would make them playable. Yeah, all of a sudden they're a threat. Typical abandon tactic: avoid and evade. Thank you, mother. Let's go this way. It seems faster. <laughs> Whisper River. I swear to God. Oh. Nope. It was not. Fa it That's was so not faster. It was not, but I can fly. <laughs> Just fly over the river. It's not hard. It's not even like a particularly like wide place in here either. It might be. It's hard to tell. If you're quit doing that, you still have to work out today and go to Walmart or not Walmart. What am I? Man, I used to go to Walmart, Walmart all the time when I lived in Marshall, but now it's such a faux pas. I have become such a new man. Hivey. And then also we gotta get food and we gotta go. Try not to be too upset about that. I'm not upset, I'm just, I'm very tired. Tired. I know you must understand that death is inevitable. And eventually, you will have to face it. Are you going to babble on about Brodus again? <laughs> Do you see that rock? Go and hit your head on it, or I will. Brodus. I'm, I'm gonna start calling him Brodus. <laughs> but Harem's not a bro. But, I don't know. Brotus who White says I punches guess, hole in wall. No, I guess it's more like, it's that new bro, like the Rick and Morty bro, who's just like, oh, I'm such a nihilist, uh. So I think you just use the word bro to talk about anyone who's masculine at all. No. So what like, does it mean in this context? So I think that there is a particular type of fan of shows like BoJack Horseman, Rick and Morty, etc. Of people who use the idea of nihilism as an excuse to not take responsibility for their actions. Like, oh, and why is that a bro? I don't, that, that's not inherently a bro. It's like a modifier for bro. There are bros that then do this. So what is bro then? Like the essence of bro-ness? Yeah. It just sounds just, derogatory, and I, you've called me a nerd bro a lot. And I, am I, not, I need to know if you're, like, calling me out. I'm not calling you out. So what does it mean? I don't understand. Like, it's hard but, to explain. Oh, you got time. Like, Figure it out. I'm trying. Try harder. I'm getting there. Whoosh. This is not the formation we're going to keep. Okay. But it is the formation I'm going to advertise. We gotta move a little farther forward. And then back. What are you doing? Putting my best feet forward. Screenshot. <laughs> okay, now. Um, I guess I think of bros as having a couple characteristics. Uh, one, they tend to brown nose important people. Oh, hi. Should I go? Just stay in there. Okay. She's waiting for me to bring her the pieces of the crown, my dude. Oh, right. Yeah, that makes sense. I assume that he would like, to, or they would just like appear when you put it together. Um, and they tend to. So, like, to superiors, they tend to talk a wreck of crap on their colleagues. To their colleagues, they tend to talk a wreck of crap on their superiors. They're just constantly trying to play whoever they can play, and whomever their allegiance to is unapparent, but usually it's just themselves. Well, that's why you call me a nerd, bro. Because my allegiance is just to myself. But, like, do you go up to your supervisor and take the opportunity to talk a wreck of crap on your colleagues? No. No, really, no. No. I'm sorry, I don't know why you got quiet when I said no. I was just reading, sorry. Yeah, um, I'm just some wood. With my new fighter levels- oh, wait. Two Moons has nothing set. Oh, no. Greater Vital Strike. I did take Power Attack, right? Okay, we're good. It's much easier. But yeah, no, I don't- I don't- care enough about either my supervisors or my co-workers at, like, work to go, and, like, say anything, really. Yeah, and they just always think of themselves as just so important. Like, 
for no apparent reason other than that they were coddled usually as children to think that they were special in some way. And so now they think too highly of themselves for like no uh, objective reason of any kind. So then my question is, like, I definitely think it's pretty highly of myself. But you have a reason to. You've actually done something. Do you really remember? Like, the thing that drives me nuts about, like, particularly bro-y people is usually it's just like, ah, oh, I'm special by virtue of who I am and nothing else. And it's like, you haven't done anything for you, right? Yeah, you, you mediocre. So then why do you call me a nerd bro? Nerd bro is not like, like, when I call you a nerd bro, I'm not calling you a bro at so all. So bro anymore. is a very, the word can mean many things. No, I'm not calling you a bro at all. Like, it's just a joke. Okay. I'll cut you! As long as you're sure. I'm sure. Is the fight done? I don't know if the fight's done or not. I have the fight is done. They're all down. We just can't loot anything on this map. Which is annoying. Okay, they're definitely all down. Okay, so one of these guys... I guess had a piece of the crown. I didn't stop to talk. Hello, crown! Uh, maybe I should have asked them where the crown piece was. Actually, it's probably on one of their bodies. We can't loot anything down. on this map. That's not true. Oh. It's just these guys. I've definitely looted all of that already. Oh. So... I'm gonna try to leave and see what happens. Because I'm betting one of those guys is carrying it. Do, 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 do. That's the whole map too, right? Okay, let's go over here. Maybe there's something I missed here. Maybe it's like in the deepest parts of the wood by the spider. Hello, crown. Not quiet. Well? Hmm. I'm gonna try to leave. I'm gonna see if it'll let me grab it then. Grab it that way. Also, I'm just still so happy because I got four fuck excuse me, puppies. One, two, three, four <laughs> puppies. Look how dope they all look running together. Too bad I can't make them as big as they should be. Yeah. That would be sweet. Alright, so I'm gonna leave the map. It should give me the option to loot more. I think. Yes. And he had a crown of there we go. Listen, you can talk all you want about proper precautions and things best left unknown, blah, blah, blah. But when someone gives you the disassembled pieces of a magical artifact, I don't care who you are. You put that baby together. As the last piece of the first crown slotted into place, the whole thing started glowing with green light and humming, and that's when things got weird. Before we knew it was happening, we were somewhere else, a distant and indistinct nowhere with misty walls glowing that same green. Before us floated an elven man, all dressed up like some sort of king. Except he wasn't a normal king, because the last time I checked, elves weren't see-through, and their skin didn't give off wisps of glow and smoke. He stared at us with his blank ghost eyes and said, You're neither witch nor worm. Who are you? You first. Who are you? The ghost king nodded. My name is Lethoriel, once called Lethoriel the Wise. You're inside what was my pride. Yes, Tommy? Fun fact. <laughs> and I screwed this up with Mahariel. But in Sindarin, the I-E-L means daughter of. Oh. I-O-N is son of. So both my male dragon disciple and this guy have an awkward naming convention. Because we assume that's where we've got basically everything from all elvendom and like D&D. The more you know... Off you go. Oh. Um. Where? Are You're inside, which was my pride. And is now my prison, which you call the first crown. He gave an ugly smile. Behind him, a door manifested in the fog. He gestured to it. Don't worry, unlike me, I suspect you can leave whenever you like. 
Time is strange here. I don't know how many millennia have passed in your world since Nerissa destroyed my kingdom of Rushwood. Only that all memory of it has been lost, with the younger races building nations atop its ashes. My people are long dead and scattered. Only I remain, trapped in this half-life, denied my proper rest, and forced to carry out petty tasks, for whichever abomination bears my crown. All thanks to the Nymph Queen. She's clearly a dryad! He looked at us expectantly, so we- Told him we were his new masters. New masters? The green light in the room throbbed with the ghost's anger, his eyes blazing. But then he smiled. Does this at least mean you killed the gnarly witch and wriggling man? That would be some consolation. Uh, consolation. Consolation, sorry. Oh, yeah, let's hold on the guild them. Stib, stib. You just need to roll a ten. No, I want to use him. That's why we need help. How can we fight him? The ghost laughed bitterly. Fight Nerissa? Child, if I knew how to kill the Nymph Queen, I would, would I still be trapped in this godforsaken crown? I can't take any direct action against her, even at the command of my bearer. He paused thoughtfully. Though I suppose her minions see my crown as the mark of station. The early witch and the wriggling man fight over it incessantly. To see it in someone else's hands might fluster them, cause them to make a mistake at a crucial moment. There was another pause, longer this time. At last, in a softer voice, the ghost said, Or, once you've left this place, you could command me to destroy this crown and set myself free. That made us all pause. We looked at each other silently, weighing our options, and then... So I'm a little busy, uh... We've had a lot of these. Right? Throughout Kingmaker, a lot of, the, like, we're in a book. Yeah. It's theater of the mind. I've never looked at the outside of the book. Like the cover. Like this bit. Yeah. That looks really good. That looks really, really good. Mm hmm. That's literally Lindsay's journal, isn't it? Mm hmm. The little stuff. Nope. Oh. The room darkened around us, the ghost eyes flaring bright like green bonfires. So, you're no better than the rest of them, then. He began to grow larger, literally expanding with rage. In that case, master, allow me to free you from this prison, as you're so unwilling to do it for me. Then we are back in the forest with a new hat. Got a forest hat. Talk to Shika. Summon two elven warrior spirits for ten minutes twice a day. What's this do for me again? Oh, that's just really good. Well, who doesn't have a hat? Everyone has a hat. Everyone has a hat. I guess we don't need this anymore. But what, do, we, what, do we have another bag of holding? We have another mastodon. That's... yeah, you're right. So yes, yes we do. <laughs> uh, let's see what that looks like. I'm curious. Show helmet. Ooh, that's kind of cool. A little too alien for my tastes. Shake her the many. Sup, my dude. So we never figured out what was up with that weird thought we couldn't get to with the mobility check. That must be where the Knurly Witch and the Poopy are. Mm. I killed you! You were in the bathroom for that. Oh. Salim, Salim, Gadafar! You look up to find Shaika waiting for you at the edge of the trees, arms crossed. Despite being dead the last time you saw him, Salim now stands in front of you, looking irritated. Yeah, I guess when your best friend's an eldest. <laughs> well, Shaika asks, did you get it for us? I killed you! Maybe you missed the part where I work for the Death Goddess. You think the Lady of Graves gives up her servants that easily? Yes, I do. Because that's her thing. He glares at you and shakes his head, but you. Murdering a traveler who's just survived a monster attack? I look forward to watching your inevitable judgment in Phrasma's court. But until then, I've got a job to do. Ooh, Let's get on with it. do you know it's got a ghost? Did I know about the ghost? Shaika smiles. Child, why do you think I wanted it? I'm far too old to be excited about fancy hats. Now are you going to give it to me or not? What's it worth to you? It's always money with you mortals, isn't it? Measuring your tiny lives and shiny pebbles. Besides, I already told you, giving me the crown will aid you in your quest against Nerissa. But if you must have a physical reward, so be it. The eldest reaches into his sleeve and pulls out a bulging sack, showing it to you before stashing it away again. <laughs> this is yours in exchange for the crown. Now do we have a deal? Mm, no. Oh, God. 
Salim laughs at Shaika's shocked expression. He grins and claps them on the shoulder. You and your type never learn, do you? You think of us mortals as dogs to be trained, but we can still surprise you. He turns to you and his expression sobers. In that case, I have a proposal. The ghost tied to this crown is a mortal soul, trapped and kept from its rightful afterlife. As an agent of Phrasma, goddess of death, I could take the crown to her realm and ensure that the ghost is put to rest safely as he deserves. It's my job, actually. He looks you in the eye. So what do you want to do? That's the true neutral response, not the LG response. I'm just saying. <laughs> I will keep it. Oh, Ha! You better run. Selene frowns. Keep it. Then you truly know better than Nerissa scum. But so be it. In that case, I'm done here. He reaches up and pulls out a spiral marked amulet from the neck of his robe. Until next time, Shaka. Surprisingly, Shaka laughs and turns a radiant smile on you. We knew you'd make the right choice. God of the future, remember? Everything's going according to plan. Now if you'll excuse me, we're late for an appointment. Or was that early? The thoughtful expression of the eldest wings out of existence. Yeah, I'm just more hung up on the, the sheer number of, of tusks. So many. That makes me so happy. But really quickly, who's Mastodon? Who's? It's important. Because someone's Mastodon, who I just don't know whose is at all. I have no clue. Not the foggiest. Wait, what? Oh, th th there's mine. I want to set him to trip. Because it'd be fun. What time yep. is it, Boo? Um, it is 10 of 7. Oh, my. Well, that means it's time to knock off for the night. That was fun. I have a fourth Mastodon. We're not quite done yet. Here's a save. So since we're super close to the end, I have decided that all of the Kingmaker, until we're done with the CD run, will be Sweet Two Moons action. There'll be a couple weeks, not this coming week, but the next two after that, we can squeeze two a week in again, and it's going to be back-to-back -back chaotic evil nonsense until we get done with this. Be sure to like and subscribe for more Mastodons. <laughs> Press F if you like Mastodons.